what, what, what Lady them are doing in LA with the brown bag. Brown bag. Brown bag is the best in here. Brown bag. Brown bag episode 112. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Powered by the watch. The watch. The watch. 112, where the players dwell. Whoa. Yes. Oh. Was 112 a group? Yes. yes. Yeah. I know that. See? Peaches Yay. and cream. You know how I know them? And cream. Well. Because I, are they are they on Sky's the Limit with, with Biggie? Yes. yes sir. Yeah. Yeah, they sing the chorus. Yeah. Sky is the limit. You know, you know. Extra points if you know which one is the one singing mainly on Ah, uh, Don't be asking me dumb questions <laughs> like that. It's the S to the L to the I to the M. Slim. His name is Slim. Shout out. Was Biggie the first rapper to add and incorporate R&B to his hooks? Because if he did it, it's not him that did it. It's coming uh, through Puff Daddy. Puff, Puff Daddy. Yeah, yeah. who executive and produced it. And he probably... You know what he did do is because he had artists that were... R&B artists and artists that were rappers and Kinda was like, like, now kids. Like, this is his yeah, best way <laughs> to collab both of his, like, genres that he was I working with. I love that. With. Oh, because uh, yeah. Fei Fei. Yeah. I, I think... Faith. Yeah, Faith. I think both, Faith. Faith. I don't know. before I like them that. was, like, the... Um, you're all I need to get back. Met the man and Mary J. Blige. And mm-hmm. Mary J. Blige was, was also Puff Daddy. Artist, yeah. Yeah. Wow, shout out Puff Daddy, Daddy man. Around. And Puff Daddy. How would you say his name in Spanish? Puffy. Uh, Matador. Oh, oh shit. Le dicen el matador. <laughs> Keep that in here because that was an amazing joke. He's a bull. That was classic. That was shake ass food. Anyways, we're back. <laughs> yeah. We're back from London. We're back from London. London. from London, bro. Did everybody tell you when you got back, like, that you're in London? I thought you're... That's yeah. all I got like yes. all weekend. I'm like, mm-hmm. dude, there's this thing called a plane and then you could come back. Bro, yeah. I time. know. I, had to, I was like, I was like, I was like, yeah, you fool me. I to, back and forth, you know. I, I dead ass was like telling everybody like, Oh yeah, because my hunger gets married. Yeah. But dead ass, we just have to come back. You know? Yeah, <laughs> top boys. And top then when boys. They're like, you're not jet lagged. I'm like, honestly, I think it's like a mindset thing. Like, yeah. I just don't get jet lagged. Yeah, I just travel. See, so we much. were in and out. Though. <laughs> like, it felt like three days. Though. It did. But we did have Nando's. Nando's was bomb. Nando's you was were delicious. sleeping while we went to get Nando's, but look, cold I made Nando's. sure we brought yeah. stuff back for you. I definitely right. had some cold Nando's. And it was good. And it no, was but good. we brought it to you warm and you forgot it. Dog, I was a He bro, forgot was, it? Yeah, he didn't uh, eat it until we came back, like, again. After, <laughs> yeah, after we came club. Uh, <laughs> that fucking club was so musty. In it. In it. It was musty in it. Dude, I like how they didn't fuck, bro. Like, it's just, the culture is so different. Like, we got in there with hats. And they were like, just put it backwards. Yeah. And yes. then, it's so weird. <laughs> oh, really? Like, yeah. like, we couldn't wear the hats while we're wearing it. We had to wear them like this. And then we're in the club and we're like three hours in. Maybe no, maybe like an hour in. Yeah. And then they're like, you can't wear them. I'm like, bro, yeah. you're looking at me for a fucking hour. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, you're picking and choosing because we're not real Spaniards. You know, we've been conquered. Oh, my yeah. God. <laughs> Other than that, London was London. fucking. London. Shit was pretty nice, mate. Yeah, it was cool. I can't wait to go back again. I mm-hmm. do Harry Potter stuff with you. Yeah, facts, facts. Yeah. I'm, 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 down, I'm down. I'm down. Yeah. I'm definitely and down. And Duno got uh, this old lady. Oh. Oh, I told you guys the old lady was trying to violate me. It was bro. an old lady in a Nike Tech. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't there. She looked like an evil about... villain. Like she came over to him, super aggressive. What was the name of the clip or the place? Tiger, what? Tiger, 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 Tiger. Shout out to the Colombian Uber driver that uh, to the recommended it. By the way, Uber drivers in in London have need to go through like a a third <laughs> process, a third process of like, like a background check yeah. or yes. something. Yeah, <laughs> one of them was a drug dealer, dead ass, dead ass. Like I swear to God, like. I know one when I see one. Oh my god! And I was in like, London. Yeah. Well, I'm like, what do we got put over with this fool? Yeah. And we look like this fool. The Colombian. And, and, and fucking now we're part of the fucking drug deal from wow, London to Colombia. But bro, yeah, the the um, I definitely was sexually assaulted in London by an old lady. <laughs> she crazy. grabbed my ass. She did. Yeah, she did. Aggr- but, aggressively. Did you like it or not? But I don't know how the rules work. <laughs> Remember, there's that card on the thing that said, "No grabbing bums." No slapping bums. She yeah. didn't read it, obviously. Yeah, but oh, yeah. bro. She's that, a love viejita. Viejitas love you. Dude, I don't know what, but she was, she was just like, hello. Like, for, they were playing, by the way, they're great DJ. Yeah, great music. The fucking DJ was amazing. And everyone, but everyone dancing was offbeat. Yeah. Bro. <laughs> bro, okay, okay. This is why, like, this is why, like, I understand why us as, like, Latinos and our culture is, is so deep and rooted, mm-hmm. right? Because, mm-hmm. like, we're just like, like if you see how our Aztecs, our ancestors dance, they were like, yeah. the Mayans, they were going Ooh. crazy. Like, <laughs> like I remember in, in elementary, I learned how to do an Aztec dance because 
You learned how to do an Aztec. Oh, my mama, I have pictures of me in the Aztec with the little Shut the acorns fuck up. on the thing. Real? Yeah, we did Shut that. Oh, we need to see that. Grants Elementary in Westlake. Give me at least a two, a couple steps. I don't remember, but I remember I did it with the homies that the homies that taught us. And Bro. we did the whole thing. We did like the spin around. I was barefoot. The spin around. You were barefoot. Bro, I was in kindergarten for the homies that time. I need to see I this. At I swear to God, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get pictures. I need to send see them it. in, and we can show them. But yeah, so fucking, and you know where I'm beat, dog. Mm. European. I'm sorry, you guys, and like yeah, whatever other coaches were there. <laughs> yeah, y'all cannot dance. There were some Spaniards there. So what if it's like dancing a of- in their way? You no, know, like, no, you know how like when they drive, well, they drive on the other side than yeah. we do. Like even the the driver no, in the car. No, because you can tell what they were side? trying to do. Bro, oh. Letty, it was fucking. Maybe they danced to the other part of the beat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they were dancing to house music yeah. to the reggaeton. Bro, yes. but it was like it was <laughs> like. It was like <laughs> it's, it's, <laughs> <laughs> like, bro, it was terrible. It was like, four. It was four uh, Spaniard girls that like they looked super white, but then they were mouthing all the lyrics to all the Spanish And then the DJ songs. was the DJ was like, "Shout out España!" Everybody was like, "Woo!" And we're me and we're like, "Oh shit!" Yeah, yeah. that shit was that shit was bad it in was there. Musty. Oh. It smelled like oh, bro. I'm, yeah, we left mm-hmm. the United States. I love you very much. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we're here. You feel yes. me? Don't you know I'm local? Let's get into it because yep. this is big for our guy Depoy. <laughs> <laughs> for, okay. for our guy Depoy and his girlfriend. Yes. <laughs> She's walking LA to- City Council yes. has designated a section of Pico Boulevard between Arlington Avenue and Westmoreland Avenue as. The Oaxacan Corridor. Whoa. Okay. Shout out my Oaxacans. To celebrate guys. the people of Oaxaca. Shout out okay. my Oaxacans. Do you, you know, know where this area yes, is? Yes, I do. It's it's like it's like a little after Pico Union, uh-huh. Westmoreland. Oh, is like, there a McDonald's by there? Uh, there's is there McDonald's? I'm, uh, I'm I think I was on Pico and I went to a McDonald's and there was a Oaxacan restaurant by there. Oh, you probably were more low, more down. Mm-hmm. But okay, so Arlington is Pico and Arlington is already considered like. Mid, Mid City, West mm-hmm. LA, mm. Pico Boulevard and Westmoreland, Pico and Westmoreland. It's kind of like in between like going towards like South Central. You're like by West Adams District. You're nice. not too far from Vermont. Yeah. You know, so, it, so it's a, it's kind of a little tricky because the Salvadorian quarter is right there where people saw all the food. Cordier? Cordier. How do you oh, say Cordier? Corridor. 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 Sorry. Say, say it in full. Corridor. No, the, everything. South- Walking Corridor. The Salvadorian. Oh, Salvadorian Corridor. <laughs> it's, 20, it's 25 cents Why is there a fucking eye there <laughs> Corridor Corridor Corridor, corridor. Salvador and Corridor yeah. <laughs> Salvador and Corridor But yeah That's just That's just on Vermont Uh huh It's on Vermont Oh and, so Are and, the and Salvadorian between, Corridor And the Oaxacan Corridor Are they gonna start they, beefy Yeah Whoa Ooh. Battle of the Corridors Because I'm trying to think like From what I know All the Salvadorian people Sell the food mm. In front of The Olympic Police Station Is Whoa. it Is, it, is it, that a, a Largely Highly populated Oaxacan area Right there Well it's I don't know, fool. I don't know. I decided this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I don't, know how, I don't know how the but I'm guessing they did it because of what the one girl said. And then yeah. like, we gotta give this to something. They're deep. Oh, oh. Yeah. remember when she was mad about yeah, Depot yeah. walking around? <laughs> yeah, that's what yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was messed up. But but see, I don't even know if Depot knows about this fake ass walking. The the Oaxacan? Oh, wow. by the way, I had an argument with this food because I, I I I don't like Clayudas. You guys What's know what that? that is? Like the Oaxacan pizza. Like it's like this big ass round shit and they have a gang of shit on it. Mm. You guys need to get in touch with our cultures. Yeah. Oh, now it's your culture? It's, 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 it's they're far cousins. Yeah, okay. But yeah, they have like, and then bro, me and this girl was just having an argument. She's also Oaxacan. No way. You found the Oaxacan queen. I love what? that. What? If they have like a super Oaxacan baby. Like, that's like, going to be powers. ugly. That's super cute. What? It's not going to be ugly. <laughs> it's going to be beautiful. <laughs> they're going to be grasshoppers. <laughs> they're going to be grasshoppers. No, but yeah, nah. Uh, the poet, him and his family... Super Oaxacan. When we went to fucking Rosarito, he was wearing his mom brought him a Oaxacan like like button up, and he was rocking it. That's oh, fire. that's so that's cute! Fire. By the way, they're very proud people. Like, yes. them for you can't tell the Oaxacan. I'm surprised nothing. they haven't fucked up, fuck you up yet. Why? <laughs> well, you know why? You know why? I'm vouching my real Oaxacans. Like mm. who? Poet's mom. She loves uh, me. Okay. Poet's family. Has she heard what you say about how they? Yeah, I call her son ugly all the time. Oh, okay. <laughs> But hey, but Poe has a great heart. Mm. And that's all that matters, right? You guys? Yeah. Right. And then the Poe's girl, she's a very pretty girl. You know what I'm saying? I'm I'm proud of him. He found a Oaxacan queen. Oh, can you say that your homie's girl's pretty? Yes. 
Yeah, you can say that. Mm. You can say that. Yeah. You can't say, man, she fun as fuck. Yeah, yeah that's, 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 that's fine. Man, you got a baddie. <laughs> you can say that, oh, you can't but you can't say can, you can, I think, I think can, it's like, how you say it. it. I think it's how you say it. What's the rules of like, how you can tell your homie? Ooh. You have to say it in passing, like, yeah, she a baddie, for sure. Like, you have to say it like that. You can't be like, like, nonchalantly? You can't be like, you can't be like, she, she, like, she, will you meet her for the first time? And she goes to the bathroom and you go like, she a bad one. Yeah. Hey, congrats, homie. Yeah, no, I think. Let me know when you're done with that. Oh, you're just like, you can't say that. Let me know, you know when you're done with that. It's crazy. Yeah, you yeah. can't say crazy. that. But, but I think if That's you're like, but I think, but, but I think if the homie were like, because I've asked the homies, like, she pretty, they'll be like, ah, oh, she's cool. Or like, nah, nah, this one is really pretty. Or like, oh, you can't say okay, she's busted okay. either. Yeah, so you, you can. So you have to wait, you <laughs> have to wait till she's you're, until they ask. Hey, no, no, no. I'll ask my homies. Like, hey, yeah, yeah. So they have to wait till you ask. Yeah, and they'll be they like, can't just be like, hey, she's pretty. Nah, nah. Like, nah. They'll be like, they'll be like, finally, or it's like clowning. Mm-hmm. But yeah. some of the homies, they just, some of them just like monsters forever. <laughs> yeah. And you tell them I'm a wild you know, like yeah, some of you guys. Yeah. That's crazy. You tell them your homies what? That, that, if their girl's busted. Yeah. Wait, like, like their girl, girl. Like, like, or like my what homie, you mean girl, like, girl. like the homie drum, I'll be like, bro, Steph's ugly, bro. Yeah. No, no, no. Because oh, Steph is his homie. Steph is yeah, his homie. Yeah. She's so ugly. No, she's not. She's not ugly. She looks like Angie and you have a crush on Angie. I don't have a crush on Angie. Stop pushing this narrative. But what I'm saying is like, that's one of those things where like, I can say that like, like I, I brought a girl or two or maybe three, even four, or maybe five. <laughs> That yeah. weren't the best looking, and the homies would be like, or maybe twenty, and, 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 or maybe twenty-seven, or maybe, or maybe thirty, <laughs> or maybe thirty-one. Whoa, whoa, you're laughing? Yeah, he's laughing. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Mm-hmm. We see yours. <laughs> tough, <laughs> tough six. <laughs> <laughs> but her heart, ten. Oh, Which one? Uh, okay. London. London. That's mm-hmm. her new name now. I thought it was Canes first. Raising Canes in London. So. Cundin. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but no, nah, yeah. So, yeah, I think, I feel like, I think with girls is different, right? Like, we, okay. Example. Like, yeah. Can you say, like, hey, your your husband is, is good looking or he's no, fine? or nobody. But that's also because I'm a toxic guy. No, but, like, can you say that to someone else's? No. Like, because for us, it's like, we're not even looking at your man. Okay, no, but that's but, a lie. But, no, but but like Angie, like her man, I'd be like, oh, I guess that's your type. Okay, okay, so oh, so, yeah. but, so you're saying he's ugly. But but you know you know what it is that I I hear my sister and their friends talking to be like, yeah, bitch, you got terrible taste. Yeah. Like I'd be like, damn, <laughs> what if she loves that fool very much? You know what I'm saying? But, but I, also, see, girls will admit. I feel like like yeah, like my husband ugly as shit, but I love the fuck out of him. Yeah, yeah. like they're openly like we will never admit I'm in that. Denial. My bitch is the baddest one in my no. Yeah, we'll we'll my more husbands be, are we'll like more babe, delusional. The, your baby, how like they they can't be ugly to you. Like you but, know how like your baby's right. never ugly. Yeah, yeah, there's ugly babies for yeah. sure. <laughs> but you can acknowledge. <laughs> so ugly so I feel like some girls acknowledge like. Oh yeah, he's not a looker, but you know he's this, he's that. He's what do you mean? Da, da. I married Brad Pitt, you guys. <laughs> yeah, I mean, but no one else can say. Would you marry Brad Pitt? <laughs> no, I said I married him. No, you married Brad Pitt. I, ma- I married the Mexican version of Brad Pitt. But yeah, I feel like I feel like you could tell your homie like, nah, fool, she's the prettiest one you've brought around. Like I think yeah. Poet, like Poet, Poet hasn't brought around like. Damn, like I've seen him with some dams, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, oh shit, fool, yeah. mata ta la verga, wey. <laughs> but do you guys like? <laughs> do you guys like compete? <laughs> oh yeah, we definitely compete. Or they have like nicknames. Like the homie P has a girl that only hits him up after twelve. Or we've only ever seen her <gasps> después de las doce, oh, and that's God. her nickname. Like she'll walk in at one a.m. and we'll be like después de las doce. That's crazy. Yeah, and, and 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 she's cool with it. Yeah, you know she's gang. But what I'm saying is like. She's cool, you know what I'm saying? But I've seen P with a little wobbler before. And then, you know, it just that's life, fool. You're not that's you're life. not always you're, you're not, not gonna always win them all. Yeah. Sometimes you're gonna hit first base, second base. Speaking of that being life, is getting scammed part of life, apparently. Because <laughs> USPS, the scam that you got, the one that got you, fool. The one that got you're me. not the only pendejo. <laughs> It's happened so Facts. much that they've actually put a warning out. Bro, that USPS shit looks so real. Put this out a-, a warning and a text about the scam that's going on. Like, Cut. don't click, don't do any of this. This is a scam. This is not real. I, I would you do you wish that would have came out before? Yeah, you a couple on months money? later. Okay, <laughs> to all the scammers that are looking to kill me because I didn't, I didn't blew y'all cover. I'm very sorry. <laughs> oh, you did. <laughs> you were the investigative journalism. Because I was, bro, je- bro. Technically, it got me, Maximo, and. Angie. It did not get me. It got Does you. This look like a scam me <laughs> they received the same text and didn't click. Yeah, no. I received that same text too. Then yeah. I was like, oh, this must be the one doing what I was talking about. Delete. Yeah, yeah but you, before you look like a scammer, you're the one that sent it. Yeah. 
You um, accidentally like spam sent it in the center. So. No. I'm the only one that didn't get it. Damn. Oh, it what it's you. Up. It must not reach my zip code. Uh, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. It's <laughs> someone she knows. Yeah. It's it someone she knows. Her contact book. <laughs> her contact. Facts, I just went into all of yours. Yes. <laughs> You're like, let's shoot it everywhere. Have no. you been seeing people reach out to you like it happened to me too? Hey, no, and people were like, oh my God, don't know how you fall for it. And those screenshots, I'm like, bitch, I was having a tough day that day. <laughs> Like, you don't know what I was going to yeah, do. Exactly. You were stressed. I was like, Maximo, Angie, look at this shit. Is this real? My, my package hasn't came. It's all over a shirt that didn't even fit you. Yeah, <laughs> you were telling fucking, me. Oh. <laughs> fucking gun <gotta> rodeo. <laughs> He just told me, remember that shirt? Didn't fit. They, they used a, a different... Uh, they bro. have weird measurements. They yes. have different... Yes. Like no, the every, arms and the and this is different, every, right? Bi- every brand has a weird message. So like... Yeah. No, and, but um, Ghetto Rodeos is shorter. So it's kind of like a, a weird little midriff vibe yeah. for well, guys. No, but you know what's crazy? Crop. No, yeah. but you know what's crazy? That their, their old... T- their other t-shirt fits me very well. Oh, gotcha. So that's why I'm like... I'm going based off like what I already have. Yeah. And this is why I don't fucking shop online. Yeah. Because every fucking girl I know that shops online... All that bitches does complain. Complain <laughs> about this shit that didn't fit her. It doesn't look like what it looked... Well, bitch, you're not a six foot five model. Yeah. All right, true, bitch? True, You're a 4'11". True. But fucking why are you parent. talking about me, bitch? <laughs> what I'm saying is, I'm, I've been going through I a lot shop of- online and we could just run through my last um, post on Instagram. Things are fitting great. They're, but see, yes. like, I'm that going, green dress that I wore at the fight, the cool little, did you see like Matrix? Yeah, yeah, okay, that yeah, was yeah, from yeah. online. Oh. But, but yeah. see, I, oh, I don't know, bro. But I was just so fucking like, <laughs> I was like, bro, what the fuck? But shout out them. I still about the t-shirt. What I'm saying is there, but <laughs> yeah. like. I, I now I know why I don't shop online. Oh, because it's like it's really like you have to absolutely. Hit or miss. Do you see like the memes like what I bought on Amazon, what I or, what oh, yeah. I ordered, what I got. <laughs> for literally, you can I'm never fall for those pictures. Yeah, it's always some like yeah. skinny like fit person. Photoshop. Yeah. Thing. yeah, yeah, yeah. I need to stop plus size models on your pictures because <laughs> <laughs> it makes you it makes you assume and it makes me assume yeah. that it. But I was just going based off what I already had. Mm-hmm. But anyway, yeah, fuck. You. Man, fuck everybody. Don't yeah. be fucking texting me. I actually got to block Speak. that email right now. Aww. <laughs> you should have for a long time ago. Block the Speaking email. Speaking of um, texting, can you text your homies that are America fans and ask them if they're going to be my friends again? <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Um, fucking peace out at the live show. He's going to run up and, 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 and fuck it down with you. That's not nice. By the way, you guys, we have a live show December 23rd at the World Series. Buy your tickets now. Selling quick, selling quick. Yeah, Damn, we, we, we sold a lot did, of we did, Yeah, we, we sold a lot of tickets. Yeah, That's fine. I'm happy about that. Especially so early. Usually we go closer to the date. Mm-hmm. But yeah. I love that we started early so we have time. You guys have time to save if you need to. Yes. Yep. To get all that good stuff in so then you can vibe with us. Hell yeah. Um, but yeah. So um, it's it's double P, dog? It's, it's P. Uh, P, the homie zoner. Oh. Uh, you know who's on your side? Andres. He's a Chivas fan. Shout out. Okay. So Andres is on your side. Um, he was at the game. He, he was at the game. Yeah. Oh, really? He was at the game. Peace of family. He wants to get down with you. Um, Fuego. Um, Fuego, what about you? Chivas. Chivas? Hey, yeah. let's go Chivas. Hey, Fuego, I want you to know that Jose is not your friend. Did you go to the game? Did you? No? Um, I hit up Jose for your phone number because I had an extra ticket to the game and he didn't answer me. Damn. So I asked... I asked Yaelene to go with me. He was busy wanking it. He was busy wanking it. A birthday wanker. So just know that you could have been there when all that stuff was happening, when everybody was getting down with each other, when they did the flare. You're right about the fights. The fights. I told you. I was there for like five minutes. There's fights in the stands already. Yeah. Hey, hey, for where people were, where that and many, then the flares because the, the smoke they were like having a freaking it's like you know the different blocks <laughs> war. on 4th of July when yes. you like do different um, Bro, yes. fireworks they yep. were doing that in the stands Bro, and you know what's crazy I didn't get the in. game did you sit on the America or, or a site on the America for, side you know what's crazy for the hunger Erica had really good seats tell the hunger you and Erica they had really good seats and they got they got they Who, just where, where they, got she? Bullied, they got bullied they got bullied out the seats the Chiva fan uh, she was on Chiva side she was an America fan and they got bullied out her seats damn like bro you, you're not Did they gonna get, see like, but 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 you know, them shit but fool, no? that shit just, nah nah oh, okay, cause I think okay. they were being cool like yeah but it's still like level like, but annoying fool, but did you yeah. see the dude that got kicked out out of um 3252 no. no, the dude that was going for the other team, they kicked his ass out of the three, two, five, oh, two, three, yeah. two. Oh, yeah, well, you it would know. happen. You can't. You, it's like can't it's a that. whole energy about that yeah. area. It's a real divide, the Chivas America. Hell it's yeah. a real like. Mm-hmm. And I would just like to say, just coming in as a new Chivas fan, Whoa. but if I was like super biased and super unbiased, 
Chivas mascot is way cooler than the, the Aguila. Hello, Aguila. No, the actual look at them. Literally look at them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The ah. Chivas mascot is actually like it has dreads. It looks ah. super cool. Yeah. 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 So sick, dog. Super sick as well. Roided up. Look at them. <laughs> if, definitely it's gonna be That's the first the time are we had. divided as a pod. Hold on, yeah. let me show you. Because I just saw them from the side, but from the side, it looked really No, nah, no, nah, they're sick. That fun, like, Chivas. super, like, dreads, long hair. Yeah, and Chivas. then the, the other one has a ponytail, has, like, a chongo. Hey, were the, the American America. Lista fans Chivas. flirting with you because they were like, oh, yeah, it's the Chiva fan, but... Yaelene was, like, very, like, super... Protective? Lippy. Yeah, and she was trying to get me to convert. Should I <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> she's, she's an America. American yeah. fan. Yeah. You know what? That rivalry, uh, uh, and, and shout out, and, and these are things that are dope, like... How Vic's like a big Raider fan because his pops is like diehard Raider. Yeah. Um, I think this is one of those things where Same like thing. it comes from a fucking like huge family bloodline. It like, comes from my grandpa for me. Like he was like, he swore he was going to play for the Chivas when he was younger. And he's from like the Guadalajara area. So it's Oh like, yeah, you guys are from there. So yeah. that, that makes a lot more sense. I don't know where America plays. They play in El Defe. Def yeah. Yeah, um, you should be an America fan. Put it in the, I put in the chat the both, the both mascots. Yeah, they look sick. I, I know what you're- from the side- and then you'll see, like, literally the the Chivas <laughs> one looks tight. He looks like... Oh, he got dreads. Yeah. Yes, he, he got looks dreads. Like he and weed. then the, the Aguila just looks like, oh, oh he okay. Looks, he looks terrible. Yeah, it's like, you didn't do your hair that day, fool. It's a big game. What do yeah, you mean? Yeah, he got the Fuego hair. I was about to say. <laughs> <laughs> Fuego walked away. Oh, as he walked away. <laughs> so, just based off the side profile of the mascots, I feel like the Chivas has a better mascot. Yeah. Ah, you know what? I think it's one of those things to where like that's like, a dope geez. ass fit. Dope. Like he looks Sheesh. like a good time. He looks like he's rock definitely dog. laughing like Wiz Khalifa. <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah, he, he that was a Rasta man. Yeah, super Blazes Rasta. It. No, and, and, and you know what's funny that I was talking to the homie Zona yesterday. I'm like, he went to the game. He's like, yeah. I'm like, you're not even Mexican. He's like, but I look soccer because he's Savi. Mm. And then I, and then he was telling me we know some fools that are part of the Porra from Chivas. And then I'm guessing he, he, he I'm guessing we're not. Porra? Like the Pura, like the fools that get down, like the fools that have like their own jersey and the, the drummers and shit. Oh, okay, okay. Like the three, two, five, two of that. Of them. Yeah, yeah, and and them fools and there's some other fools we know that are America, part of the America Porra, and they know each other. They play like in the same soccer team, but when they see each other at games, they get down with each other. That's <laughs> and I'm like, and I'm like, they like, get down with each other. And I'm like, what's up with you fucking creep ass fools? You just squabbling each other. Yeah. But so um, even at the game, like I could tell the rivalry was for real. So. On the Chivas side, that that area, the three two five two of Chivas, they put this big banner that it went back, 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 and it had a bunch of face faces of all the famous like Chivas players, right? And then it said like in in Spanish, these people made us great, not the TV, because I'm assuming that America gets played a lot on the TV. So what mm -hmm. they're saying is like you guys are only great because you guys get played on TV. We're great because of how great our players have been, like our legends and all of that. And I was like, oh my gosh, the this is just crazy like, yes. out here. Yeah. But also, and then the America people were like, well, don't invite hosts to the hotel. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and, and but I was oh, like, and Eileen was shitting on Chivas because she was like, you know, America is for the people that are like really from where they're from and it's super authentic and like hometown. And da -da. <laughs> the way you're talking that, is exactly that's like, she her. Was, she's like and you know, like, Shout Chivas, her for being Chivas passionate. She's a little bit more stuck up, but like, if you're really like rooted, then you could, you always kind of go for Chivas, for America. And I was like, hold on, because I asked my dad before I left, I said, Dad, who should I go for? And he's like, Chivas, mija. And I was like, all right, we're riding. And my dad is from Guanajuato, Pueblo Nuevo, Guanajuato. There was fucking no electricity until like a couple years ago. Yeah. So I was like, what you mean? Yeah, she, she, I think my mom, because there's two teams in El Defe. It's, it's for America and Cruz Azul. Mm -hmm. Obviously, America's the bigger, better, the brand or whatever. But I remember my mom saying that Cruz Azul was, was for represented for, for the, the people, people, like the poor and shit like that. Yeah. Wow. But, 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 but America has greats, bro. Yeah. Oh, our, our, our favorite goalie of all time. Ochoa. Ochoa. I learned that yeah. at the game. <laughs> Guatemo Blanco. Yeah, have Guatemo Where's Blanco. Chicharito? Chicharito's Chivas. 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 Like yeah. his pops yeah. and his grandpa. Yep. Yeah. So it, it's, it's honestly one of those things to where like, you love to see it because it, it's forever going to yeah. be a rivalry. Yeah. But you're a, a Chivista now. Yes, I, oh, that's what it's called? A Chivista, is, a Chivista, Chivista Americanista. Gang. Yeah. But um, yeah. Do you know what down. the Chive is? No. no. Chive? <laughs> yeah. That's what they call girls. Uh, oh. Shut up. You guys are the dudes. I never heard I don't, I've that. never Jose. heard that. I thought it was a food. LV. <laughs> Potato and chives? I thought it was food. Jose. Yeah. I, don't, I don't know what it is. Yeah. Let me, okay. Let me just, Put, just Google the chive. Hey, yo. Hey, Letty, hey, why do you know about the lab? Why does it say? Okay, right there it says slang, right? Go 
Hit the, down, the, down, the, down. the, the next one. Yep. Yeah, Australian right cherry? I mean. Oh. Whoa, Letty, what website are you on, bro? Yeah, you I don't know. To... Just new people. You know how people say the hub? The chive was something that people say like how they say the hub. Damn. Yeah. All right. Anyways. Shout out to the chive us. Anyways, anyways. <laughs> but anyways, Vic saw his ex chive this weekend. Yeah. Vic. Vic what? I saw his ex chive this weekend. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Which one? And I'm no, on. Uh, one of them. No, it was just it was just a trip. Um, Wait, which one of the one of them? Just I don't know. I don't. She doesn't have a nickname. She's been around a long time behind the scenes, you know, doing her thing, uh, uh, holding me down. Oh media, my god, is it Earth Cafe? No. no, this is a media kit. No, <laughs> I love no. the names. Yeah, I, I, we never Earth gave her Cafe nickname. is baby girl. Earth no, Cafe Earth is Orchata. Cafe. No, 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 no. Yeah, no, she no. is. Earth Cafe is Orchata, right? I guess she brought Earth she, Cafe. Yeah. Glockiana. Yes, yeah, she. Do you Not know Glockiana. she did? No, I'm just you know. Glockiana. Not she her. in jail, wait. <laughs> Which one is it, man? She's a hard time. I'm, I, I as don't have confused a as you are about her, we are Which about... Which one is I don't it? I have a nickname for her. All right, show us her IG real quick. Yeah. No. So how Bro! do you know your, How do you know oh my God. Eggs? I told Maximo I thought it was confidential, you asshole. Oh, <laughs> so which, I text which him on X? the side. I added it because I was like, we need balance. <laughs> which X? Which X? I don't know. No, he doesn't. He didn't know. So tell what did he what say a fucking ex is it, bro? Christ. Oh, the one you ran into at the club one time that was like, hey, I'm Big Sex. Oh. <laughs> uh, she doesn't have a nickname, though. She doesn't have a nickname. She's, she, for she wanted like, like, she, for either rope. Oh, 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 we could call her Volcano because she's from Honduras next to the volcano. <laughs> she call her Volcano is a crazy name. <laughs> Ladies, this is what you sign up for. Just, <laughs> I don't feel sorry for you anymore. So, so the camera, I don't by feel By the way, sorry by the way, she did come up to me and was like, I'm Big Sex's girlfriend at the club in front of everybody. That's crazy. And I was, just That's like, a wild well. statement, and I was yeah. like, "Wow!" But you saw her, and and you, yeah, no, it was, it was. Did you guys dance or yeah, mac we, it down? We danced a little bit. Yeah, we. Uh, <laughs> we danced a you danced bit. at the menace party. Yeah, shout out to to menace. Uh, shout out to don't fucking you turn it into brown pride. Shit. They don't did. turn it into brown on, pride. No, no, they did shout ten menace, years, but not shout out ten, out ten years of greatness. Ten years of greatness. Let me run through this really quick. Ten years of greatness. Let me run through this real quick. Just like he's running through the girls real quick. Um, Kane's happened at, at like a probably less than first of all you had a whole girlfriend last month <laughs> mm -hmm. was it last month? it was like beginning of last month when this she food. went down yeah hold up let's <laughs> okay you have a whole girlfriend that Clip time. now you're out of being her man yeah. and then you three finger combo a girl at the club allegedly, allegedly. that didn't happen it just looked then like then we it. go to Vegas and you like tonsil hockey with a girl out there from Seattle from Seattle, from, which is for, different from Three Finger Combo. For her nickname is Deprimida. Deprimida. It's Deprimida over there. Oh, because it's Colorado. depressing. She's from Colorado. Oh, Colorado. Oh. Jesus. Yeah. La Rocky. No, we'll call her Groupon because you got her flight on a Groupon deal. <laughs> <laughs> it was a steal. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then what happened after that? Okay, so then we go to London and you meet up with Three Finger Combo again. And this is all happening within weeks, days of each other, you guys. And then... <laughs> Probably as a single. This past weekend, you dance with, hey, I'm his ex. Yeah. He's single. Dancing isn't bad. Yeah. Hey. But hey, the, you know, the funnier part. His dancing is bad. The funny part. Have is you that. seen his dancing? <laughs> <laughs> no, hey, wait till that Bobby Smarter come yeah. on. He's got to applaud. No, Bobby. he's piece of shit. <laughs> That's just the guy who's clapping. <laughs> He's getting his son. Oh right my god. <laughs> Thank you guys. I couldn't have done it without you. Honestly, I couldn't have done it without all of y'all. Um no, yeah, but the funniest part is that I get there, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go with Swift, and then he lags, and I'm like, man, this is like two blocks away from my house. This I'm like, just go. There's no excuse for me not going. Like, you know, they did 10 years. They I one of my favorite clothing brands, lots of Latino pride. Yeah, shout out man. I knew I was gonna know a lot of people there anyway. So I show up alone. As soon as I get there, I try to get in line, Jizz calls me. And she's literally Another right ex. in front. She's not my ex. No. But she's literally right she's in front. <laughs> <laughs> she's a She's right in front. She's like, go home. And I was like, go home. What the fuck? Where are you? I'm like, you're here? She's like, yeah, I'm in the car behind you. I'm like, what the fuck? She's there. Say what's up to her. But she doesn't come inside. Oh, my gosh. And then, and then so I get in line. Say what's up to the homies or whatever. And then, yeah, then I run into her. I run into my barber. It was, it was cool. It was vibe. Depends. So you have even a whole other group of girls that's not your exes, but have done things with you. Yeah. You have a whole other category. I guess so. <laughs> I wouldn't categorize them myself because oh I just, God, you know, just I just have that. a... <laughs> 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 you know, I just, I love hard. You know what I'm saying? And you it's just love like, hard. Love hard. I have a 
big heart, honestly, and that's just all it is. That's all it comes down to. He heard you know? every girl by Lil Wayne and Drake and just fucking has been running with it ever since. But shout out to Mendez, 10 uh, years. 10 years. Yeah, just, uh, see? See what your band is associated with right now? Yeah. I like, I like You're a menace. <laughs> You're legit a menace. Ten years of uh, <laughs> ten, years. ten years of fuckery. <laughs> they're, cele- they're celebrating you, <laughs> dude. What you did in ten days is what they <laughs> ten years. A decade of dedication. All right, Duno. <laughs> yes. Congratulations to your happy couple friends. Yeah, yes. yeah. Shout out Jenny and Maria. They just got married. This Let's weekend. go. They just got married. By the way, you guys need to start getting married. I was just telling the guys right before you walked in that bro, weddings are fucking fun. Yeah. Did anybody cry? Um, I think we all did. Yeah. Oh. Oh. But I didn't like cry like ah, but like it was like it was a beautiful moment. Tears, teared up. homie. You teared up. Tug, a thug tear. A thug tear. Mm. A thug one. You got a new tap? Sorry. Um. Yeah, I got my mom's name tatted. Oh, Shout out Remzer. I love crying at weddings. I want to go support him. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I no, love it. just I love it. It's so beautiful it's to so cry beautiful. and like happy. You know what? Like happy cry. <laughs> you know what? I feel like they they like at least from our like our personal friend group mm-hmm. they. Fucking gave us all our first jobs up. Like they yeah. were like picking us up, dropping us off, fucking just doing the most while we were with them. Mm-hmm. And I think she, it's kind of like, it low key kind of felt like, like kind of like mom and dad getting married. Like yeah. it was like, it was like they yeah. used to like, they, none of us had cars and you There's, know, they, they used to do the most for us. So that's awesome. That's fire. So um, seeing them get married was lit and it was, bro. Oh my God, are you crying? No. <laughs> <laughs> but weddings are so much fun, bro. Okay. They're like literally like you fully gotta start getting married. Yeah, I love weddings. I agree. Weddings that was my first fun. time at a wedding. I think really. I honestly yeah. think you're gonna be the first one to get married. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, too. yeah. Mm-hmm. Should this I have one one's of those, like, not gonna get there. This one definitely. This he would have done married. it by he would have done it by now. No, I'm gonna get married. He would have done it by now. <laughs> no, I'm gonna get married, yo. <laughs> okay. Um, do you know before we move on and before we show anything, do you know who Pee Wee Herman is? Yes, he just I know. Away. Yes, I know. Pee- Fumu Herman, that's what they were calling me. Fu Herman or whatever Fu they were Herman? calling me. Who called you that? But why would the, anybody call you that? The Instagram was going crazy. No way. Oh. I posted. I knew. Bro, by the way, the Hunger Maria has no fucking taste. The fucking colors were trash. Okay. But it was her wedding. You know what? And, so you and, went with it. And we had to. Did you know before you posted it who Pee Wee Herman was? Yes, I did. Did you know that you looked like him before you posted it? Well, I'm guessing me and all my homies look like them. Because um, no, bro, my homies. Okay, so. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize. I didn't realize how similar, how similar the color was. But honestly, I didn't. no, no, this is the suit. <laughs> this what? is the suit in extra large. Your face is so cute, my little papacito lindo. But do you know who that guy is? Yes, I do. I, I, everybody knows who people tell, remember. Tell is. me about him. He's he's a legend. I just know he's a legend. <laughs> How is he? How did he, he laugh? Dance. You almost, I kind of did it a little bit. He danced. Does anyone know how to do the Pee Wee Herman laugh? Was he not a little creepy though? Yeah, he was. Yeah, yeah, yeah like big be. creepy, right? I thought yeah. I thought he was creepy when he Low was a kid. Key, he the this wanker. generation's version of that guy is Blippy. If you're a parent, you know who fucking Blippy is, and yeah. Blippy is like the Before grown the man that dresses like a kid that is, or like dresses a weird way, and then is like, "Hey, kids, want to learn what an excavator is?" Yeah, I don't trust. And then. This one did yeah. a cool dance. Dun, yeah. dun, 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 dun. And then Sada Baby. Uh, I think Blippi it. had similar charges as him too. Dang. Previous oh. to be Blippi. No way. Yeah. Dang. This, so the YouTube space and like these people is crazy. But he's so so the the mom of Ryan Ryan's story yeah. review. Yeah. She robbed before. She caught caught stealing. No way. And it's crazy that she got caught stealing and then she had him fucking do toys and all that shit and That's then like now they fire. get free shit yeah. and now she probably steals his money she's on the come up for she sure the shit <laughs> okay so who wore it better um um Duno or um Pee Wee Herman I definitely wore it better definitely I Duno I don't know what charges he has you could have you could have wore white so shoes he, that um, been cool, he jacked though. off in a theater but it was like yeah. an adult theater and Duno has never I have never jacked off <laughs> at a theater <laughs> So just all, we hope. Yeah. based off that alone, I'm gonna say Duna. That Duna wore it better. Yeah. You know what? His was tailored better. Our tailor sucked. And that was your final fitting. Bro, uh, bro, let the I promise you we went in. <laughs> okay. I went in there, right? And and me being just like, by the way, let's keep in mind oh, that I've never so been cute. to a wedding. I don't know, I don't know many people like I'm thinking we're gonna wear black with white. Mm-hmm. Bro, yeah. my fitting, the first fitting was fire. I was like, oh. Looking flat. I'm like, oh, I'm looking crazy. And I was like, I was just, I was, I was feeling, I'm like, oh, I'm finna crack a little hose in the, you know, oh you feel me? Oh my gosh. But bro, and then I went in there and then the homies, we have a group chat and they're like, fucking Maria, te pasas de verga. 
And she's like, fuck yeah, that's my wedding. I was like, why? Wasn't color so bad? But keep in mind, we're in London. Mm -hmm. So we're picking up our suits a day, two days before. And I'm getting the text late. We're fucking busy running around doing shit. And I'm like, fool, how bad is it? And I call the homie Andy and he's like, fool, it's bad. I get there. I'm like, oh my God. Mm -hmm. But I was like, fuck it. We still had a good ass time. Mm -hmm. I, I, I want to laugh like him. Andres took some pictures. I'm excited to have him. But One bro, of you fools knows how to laugh like Pee Wee Herman. I think we want to laugh like Pee Wee Herman. It's a funny laugh. <laughs> or something. I just Please remember just he, he danced to that uh, Tequila Sunrise song. Dun, 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 dun. Does he laugh Hold crazy? Oh. That one. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that's creepy, bro. You're laughing. It's bringing you happy. It's bringing back memories. Yes. For when he touched you. Yeah. No. No. no, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> he had a classic movie. Before we move on, um, oh, shout out to you being in Jay Worthy's video. Yeah, shout yeah. out to Jay Worthy, man. Yeah. Bro, that was that's so fire. Yeah. Shout out to him. They, Jay Worthy's like real LA cultured out. Mm -hmm. I, I love everything he does. You feel me? Like, yeah. and yeah, shout out him. So he hit you up and what was he? What was he no, no, no. He, he, um, oh, there you are. He did Aww. the. He did. Um, I think he did like just like a random one of the music videos where he's like going he's around just just random places. Ran, oh, yeah. And, so this was without your permission. Yes. Wow. But they kept they you in it. it. They kept yeah. it. That no, means no, but you're viral. No, but he put up to show love to a Jeezy when he had to show at the Palladium, uh -huh. and he was shooting like a music video. He got a gang of people in it, like, uh -huh. Uh -huh. and I thought uh -huh. that was dope. Uh -huh. Shout out Jay Worthy. Yeah, shout out Jay Worthy. Yeah. Okay. Him From your friends about. to my friends. Can Jen, can you come over here? Jen, make some noise for my friend Jen De Leon. Um, what part of what part of Latino America does Jen is Jen from? You told us already, she's Filipino. Aww. That's also what Latino. Would you have thought I yeah. was. Uh Salvadoran or Guatemalan. Why? <laughs> Because you're dark and short. Oh my oh, god! So, dark and short. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. So that's what I'll say now. You from can now say on it. They think that. You definitely could pass off like maybe even a little Oaxacan. You have your own. She does not now. have no, a it's single corridor because of the wavy hair. She Whoa! Why are you taking her yeah, hair? Are you her hair is usually straight. Her no. last name is De Leon. So you oh. say it so much more like Spanish. I just say De Leon. De Leon. But oh, we like the tequila. Yeah, they're kind of like Mexican. We're Mexican. We have the same. You're Mexican. You just eat puto. And we don't eat puto. You do. No, uh, you've no. never? I have. You see? <laughs> I don't. No? You don't eat no. it? No. What are is you it? vegan? No. Not at all. I like lupus. I'm like the furthest thing I from said, vegan. I said, I said, are you vegan? That's just a fucking <laughs> like, girl. that's just a dessert. I haven't <laughs> yeah. seen Jen in a long time. Jen has been my friend longer than Angie has been. Whoa. Whoa. So then why isn't Jen Whoa. part of brown bag? Well, I'm just kidding. I don't know. I just, I just, you like how I just started to be Me and Jen have actually, like, we've done a lot together and we've been like, what I love about Jen is she's the homegirl that we probably won't see each other for a long time, but when we see each other, it's like vibes and no one gets their feelings hurt about the other one. You know, some girls, especially, they're like, oh, you haven't talked to me, you haven't texted me. Mm. Jen is not like we that. We literally will ignore each other sometimes, but yeah. then we'll see each other a year later and it's fine. It's yeah. How'd you guys meet? A red carpet. So Jen worked oh, yeah. at Hot New Hip Hop. Wow. And I worked at Power and uh, we did a red carpet for like some one random movie. It was like a project kiss not no. Like a project X type of type of movie. Oh, okay, okay, okay. And Party I met her on the red car carpet and since then we've been friends. Ooh, yeah. Uh, um, but I want to talk to you guys about Oh, uh, uh, for sure, way less than you. But, uh, <laughs> but we have a very successful podcast together. She <laughs> knows. <laughs> she knows. Uh, <laughs> Jen is probably the most successful out of all of us. <laughs> Secondly, um, she also works with the Dodgers. Yeah, so we're not taking She works with the Rams. Next season. Next season. And when she started, when she started, she worked at, with the Bulls. So like oh, she uh, is like vibes. Mm, shout out right. to her. Shout out that's to right. Jen. Uh, shout out Jen, man. And then the other day she did a panel with Jorge. Jorge did like this this oh, I've seen that. industry I've seen that. connection yeah. panel, right? Yeah. And it's for Hispanic Heritage Month, and Jen is on it. Hey. <laughs> but Jen's Filipino. Don't tell nobody. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I was supposed to be the moderator, so technically it wasn't bad, but then someone dropped out last minute, and then they were like, can you be a panelist? I'm like, can you not ask me Latino culture questions? <laughs> <laughs> what part of it are you from? Huh? She's from Chicago. Chicago. I'm from Chicago. From the shy. Oh. But I've been here. How long have I been here? 11 years? Yeah. Wow. Okay. I love Chicago. Have you ever been to a historic Filipino talk? Once. So is it bad? I'm I'm like the worst Filipino. No, she's not. How are you the worst Filipino? She like Why sets up Filipino events here. So you're not the worst Filipino. Mm. I, no, I like, like, I don't like Whoa, the most up. popular Filipino foods. Oh, like oh. that's much. So like adobo. Uh, that doesn't make you cool. the worst Filipino. I know worse Good. Filipinos. Do you like, like Jollibee? I do. Jollibee's do you like Jollibee? fire. Jollibee is it's, it's okay. They have really good fries. Okay. But, okay. Jollibee's fire. But, but, yeah, but Jollibee is just like 
So Filipinos is like, ah, it's kind of like the Japanese people, Yoshinoya is not really food. The spaghetti. <laughs> oh my God, that's real. I think the, to everybody, Yoshinoya is It's like our food. Taco Bell. Yes, or like Chipotle. Yeah. Uh, no, okay, okay, so Jen drives really far for food. What's the furthest you guys have ever driven for food? Just okay, for food. what do you mean by like how far? Like are she you made me drive to Vegas before Canes was out here <laughs> to try Canes, and at that time I'm like, why are you gonna drive to Vegas for chicken wings? But chicken. that's chicken tenders. Chicken tenders. <laughs> Four hours. Yeah, but we drove we went, to Vegas. We went there for something else too, though, right? No, it we wasn't. Went just, for, no, there was we no the way. It was, I don't even believe. <laughs> and that. then she's made me dri- drive to Buena Park. Buena Park for a salad. At Port- a really good Caesar Which salad one? at Portillo's. Okay. Have you guys have ever been to Portillo's? No. I've never been to Portillo's. We gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And we have a we have a debate because Portillo's, it has two L's in it. Por so, Dios. Portillo's. Portillos. Portillos. Yeah. It's not though. You don't, it's just she says it's Portillo's. <laughs> it is Portillo's. Is it, not just because uh, I say Italian? it. Italian? Is it Italian? Yeah, but you also it's say De Leon. Yeah, and your last Leon. name is De Leon. It's De Leon. You were definitely conquered by the same people that we were conquered yeah, by. So we, it's definitely. We, we still speak their language. De Leon, but uh, um, the farthest I've drove, I drove to uh, TJ once for tacos. Oh, Where's that's that? good. That's good. TJ, you don't know what TJ is? Oh my god, <laughs> she's from Chicago. Letty, Letty, stop in your friends. Tijuana. <laughs> <laughs> Let's it's, see. it's by T- San Diego. T- it's by San Diego. She's from T- Chicago. Tijuana, <laughs> Tijuana. Oh, okay. I know where that is. T- 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 TJ. <laughs> TJ is Tijuana. Yo, did you guys know that? That's it. That's it. Shut up. Leave her alone. Okay, girl. There was no TJ Maxx. It was a TK Maxx, but it was the same logo. Oh, yeah. Literally it literally was the same logo. It was so weird. You drove to Portillo's. Portillo's. Portillo's for Caesar salad. Portillo's. And fries. Which originated in TJ. Yeah. TJ Caesar salad. Caesar salad. Caesar salad. And by the and by the and by the way, you want to go have a salad and fries? You might as well have fucking. <laughs> <laughs> no, so just have, have the burger. Stuff. And for your life, a trip. They huh? have they have burgers. They have Italian beefs. But like, I will never buy a salad anywhere. But it's their dressing. Their dressing uh, is like crap. So we went for the dressing <laughs> <laughs> and the fries and the chocolate cake. <laughs> All right, stop judging my There's no point of the salad asshole. if you're gonna eat chocolate cake. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her. Look at her. It's okay. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, four hours for Razy Kids is crazy too. Yeah. But yeah, I, I got to TJ for tacos. That's ones. good. That's good. That's because they have the like actual, like their tacos are like yeah. what you can only get there. Horse them here. meat. No. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. How, how about you, Vic? <laughs> what? Have I driven far? Yeah. Uh, Probably to Sonic because you know there's no Sonic in the way. In Duarte? No, Palm no, Freaks? Palm no Freaks? Uh, Anaheim. Oh, that's pretty far. Yeah. But for, like, I didn't know there was one in Anaheim. Or Fullerton? Yeah. I don't know. There's a Sonic in Duarte that I've drove to from. From yeah, see, LA to Duarte. That's not crazy. For what, if, for a frozen lemonade? Honestly, like their food isn't great, it's but not it's just good. a lot. You, know, like, you, you know, just, you can order like 12 things. And it's only food. good if you want sponsors. <laughs> <laughs> so if you want to know why we went to Sonic, because they had dropped the pickle shit and one of the homies likes pickles <laughs> and they had dropped the pickle icy thing and we went. Oh, that's for the I would go that to try cool. it. Fucking yeah. terrible. Not icy uh, pickle? Yes, they did like they did like this thing. A pickle icy gr- gross. That sounds gross. Um, yeah. but I Fucking try terrible, it. but it was but their food isn't bad. What's the furthest you've driven, Maximo? For food? Mm-hmm. Mm, probably TJ. But it wasn't like I drove there for food. It was like a planned when trip you went to there, go eat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it was like let's eat. Let's find vibe. something when no. we get there. Yeah. Uh, She'll so, literally be like, "Hey, I want Portillos. Let's go." And it's will drive at 2 p.m. And it's far. Like, to me, the OC is far. Like, I'm from the San Fernando Valley. Bro, that shit is far. far. OC is hella far. To her, it's not as far because she's from Chicago. So, to her, it's like anything is pretty much either far or close. You have to go to different states sometimes to go eat in Chicago. Yeah. What do you mean? You have to go to different states. You got to go to Indiana. You go to Whiting. You go to different places. Oh, he has a lot of family in Chicago. Yeah, White Castle is in I Indiana. I love White Castle. So whenever <laughs> I, I'm I'm at my family's house, they're like, "Oh, let's go to White Castle." You have to. It's not far. It's like twenty minutes. You have to go to White. Where's your family at? It's like southeast side. Oh, close. Chicago. Yeah, right yeah, by White Indiana. Castle when I went home. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's good. All right. Yeah, well, Jen, shout out you. For yeah, being shout you. out you, Jen. Let's speaking of food though. We got food here. Let's cut to eat some food, okay? Yeah, we'll yeah, right yeah, back. Yeah. We'll take a break. Can you get a thirst trap with me? Mm-hmm. That's crazy. Bro, don't ever ask me that again. <laughs> That's crazy. Ever, ever. Uh, yes. big, big June vibes. Big June vibes. Yeah, you changed crazy. Boy. Top boy, boy for real. Yeah. Top boy for real. Crazy. 
<laughs> when you get whoa. Yo. <laughs> Anyways. No, don't say them. Him. <laughs> no. Shout out Hugo. Man, shout out Hugo Naturales. Side, remember that other fool? I'm gay. I'm gay. <laughs> shout out Hugo Naturales from Honey <laughs> Sam Park. Yes. Yeah. Shout out uh, Mama Rosalia. He wants to Hugo Naturales. <laughs> shout out Mama Rosalia. Mama Rosalia, yes. Sergio and Christian, they came through. Bought us some tortas, tortas some abachiles, some flan, everything. Bro, Dude. their tortas were fire. fire. So good. So good. Yeah, I'm they even made like, me wow. like a little keto option. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, keto boy. And then they have a michelawas, which is this is agua de sandia with like some chamoy in there and like little that chunks of so sandia. Bomb. It's so fire. Oh, you want to go crazy? You. Uh, shout out them. Shout out Hugo Naturales. And yes, I am crazy too. Mm-hmm. Just yeah. saying in the membrane. Um, <laughs> uh, yesterday I was at the homegirl Maria's sister's house. Mm. Um, and her and her man, shout out Diego. He works like transporting like big loads of like different things. Uh huh. And in his house, I saw those keto chips that that, oh, that, that you used I would to, bring? Yes. Oh, that's so tight. The protein and I was like, chips. And she was like, he was like, he's like, you know those? And I'm like, let the, I'm like, Aww. I'm like, when I read that part, she used to eat them because she was on a keto diet. And yeah. they were like, oh, I'm like, that worked? I'm like, bro, you lose a lot of weight. Yeah. And I'm like, I let the, but yeah, I saw those oh, chips. Oh, so cute. So shout out to Keto Vibes, man. So he shout just buys them for food. About me. No, no, no. No, he doesn't. He works like, so he like transports like different brands, different oh, things. Oh, and that yeah, was one of the And I'm, I'm well, not going to say the home truck a little bit. <laughs> Did you bring any? <laughs> yeah, do you want? I'm, I'm, I'm asking yeah. for like a box. That would be tight. Bro, oh, but so a box is falling expensive. off the truck. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> he works for a fucking company. Yeah. He's yeah. his own boss, technically. And sometimes so they have extra. Packages. Oh my they God. Lose. If, if he loses anything, that means I'm not going to put the homie out there like that. <laughs> Point is, the homie had to fucking keto chip. Then I was like, oh, I know those. And he's like, but everybody was surprised that I knew them. Aww. He's like, you know, I'm like, bro, let these to eat those shit. And he's like, you Aww. like them? And I'm like, I'm like, you they, ate them for you would eat. No, yeah. no. I, I said, yeah. I said they're not my. I'm not like going to the store and buying them, but they're not bad mm-hmm. if they're right there. So shout out those. Yeah, shoes. they're good. Um, thank you for being nice to my friend. Who Jen? Yeah, yeah, she's a very nice girl. Yeah. Shout out Jen from Chica- Chicago. A Filip- Chicago. A Filipino. A Filipino Chicago. Chicago. Chicagoan. Yeah. It's crazy. Yeah. She, she could be Oaxaca now that you think about it. Do you think she's from Obla? <laughs> Bang, man. Clearly. Definitely not. Yeah. <laughs> no. okay. But shout out her. Yeah, shout out her. She's awesome. What are we doing next? Let's talk about these Disney movie memes, okay? Yes. Oh, this um, is my favorite thing on so the So someone right at now. Pixar, I what I feel like right now is they're having meetings at Pixar, Disney Pixar, like, what are these Latinos sending us? And why are they all sending us these these yes. these fake memes? Who are these people? Yeah, who are these people and what is this that they're sending and they're adding our our logos to? Okay. So they <laughs> remix legendary legendary Latino shit, but Disney Pixar vibe to yeah, make yeah. it seem like there would be a movie called Edgar. <laughs> Edgar or Yahweh. 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 Yeah, up and neck away. The and iconic you know, story of like I, like I, 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 Edgar. Edgar. And if you guys don't know what that is, it's a very legendary video for us. Latin people, yeah. us Hispanics. This video has um, taken over our culture. Yes. Has has stampled our culture. I one of our first viral videos as yes. a community. Yeah. Yes. And you guys, this is like Aiden Silver Tooth activities in yeah. back in the day. You know what's crazy is we were doing our research and it turns out that the dude that shook it wasn't even Edgar's friend. No. Yeah. It was Edgar's cousin's friend. He didn't even know the fool that was shaking yeah, the... what a dick. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> he was and like, I feel like... Yeah, go ahead. No, he was just saying, he was saying that like, he's like, if it was my cousin, it would be different. Like, that's but, my cousin. Yeah, but it's someone even know I didn't even know. <laughs> yeah, that's way! Pinche pendejo, wey. Ya idiota. Also, do know, would you be the pusher or would you be the faller? You know what? I'm a piece of shit. Fool. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You would do it to someone you don't even know. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, I've, mm-hmm. I've definitely like, like I said, like when, the, the, like, like in high school when like when there was just people opening their locker barely, I'll just pass by and like close their locker. <laughs> like, you know, like, what a dick. <laughs> or like people walk by, nerd. Yeah. <laughs> no, like, or or like I definitely was like, yeah, I was a piece of shit. Yeah. But like in a like in a like the food it, I was. It's the, funny. It's comedy. It, it's definitely it's for funny. For the sake of comedy. For the sake of comedy, okay. I was just doing it. It was only like, funny to you. Yeah, I yeah, know. <laughs> I was definitely like walking in yeah, like. Yeah, because I don't think the Edgar thinks it's funny. Bro, oh. if we all laughed about this shit, then it was funny. You know what I trip out on? Because yes, there was the cousin's fr- friend that did the pushing, and then yes, it was Edgar that fell. It was the cousin that uploaded it. Yeah. And, and yes. he titled it La Caída de Edgar. <laughs> so that he could share it. With dick. all his other cousins. And then it went so and viral. Then it went viral. <laughs> and then remember he was like, he was like, I think he was talking to his dad. Mm-hmm. And he's like, tell him take it down. Tell him. We don't know how. <laughs> yes. And then they to took it, it down. They tried to yeah, take it down. But, but it's like after that, it it's was been viral shared. already. Yeah. There's Bro, no such thing. That shit is funny. Yeah. And Disney, you should definitely make a movie about this. Oh, yeah. that'd be amazing. Because it'll be like the whole adventure or like 
Why were them just crossing a rio yeah, like where, that? Where were they? Yeah. I have so many questions. Yeah, yeah. The but climax of the movie will be when he falls and then something else. Like, like maybe he, he actually life. falls in, in the uh, yeah, in the maybe. river and oh. then it starts the journey. Yeah. A magical to come back. land or something. Yes. Oh. Ah, se bañó. Yes, I yes. like it. I'm not mad at that at all. Yeah. Okay, and then Canelo shared a oh. post of, and we all fell for it because Canelo posted it. Fuck right. this. Um, Canelo Studio. By the way, who, by the way, whoever whoever is like these editors are amazing. Yeah. Right there, he looks Italian. No, he, yeah, looks, he, looks looks like, flag. he looks like Conor McGregor. Who the fuck is that guy? <laughs> yeah. Who the fuck is that guy? Oh but right God. there, you could actually, the next one you can actually tell it's the Mexican yeah, flag. Yeah, for sure. Bro, bro, if they make a movie, a cartoon movie out of Canelo, that shit will be so legendary. It's so cute. Hey, charge your, your laptop, whoever is showing the screen, because it's about to die. <laughs> but yeah, man, shout out Canelo. And yeah. shout out whoever's doing these, because yeah. like, David, they went of La Monja. You see that yeah, one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the La Monja one was sick mm-hmm. too. The La Monja one. And was I was sick. like, bro, these shit are funny. Yeah, I feel like, you know what? I, uh, on the way back from London, I was watching Coco. Yes, I saw it. I was there. And I was like, bro, they need to make more movies like this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they a piece of shit with. Yeah. <laughs> Terrible friend. So we no, had every, the, cool the, the, the flight on the way back was packed. <laughs> okay, yeah. you guys. On right? The flight there was not packed. Not packed. Everyone got their own role, all of that good stuff, right? The flight on the way back was packed. And so they sat in Maximo by me. I chose my seat. Like I went into the online website, check. I chose my seat, which was a window seat. And then Maximo was like, oh, I'm the one right next to you. And I was like, ill, because I picked a, a row that had no other people there, like mm. I on purpose, but they put him in there. And so I'm like, hey, if no one is sitting in the other seat, we can just have, like, we space. can have a seat between us yeah. so we have space. And then he just turn, he just looks at me because he could see you. I'm by the window, he's more towards the aisle. He's like, Duno wants to come over. <laughs> Duno, Duno's Duno. a big ass yeah. kid, wow. bro. He's like, I don't want to like, sit next to the old people. Yeah. Let me see what you guys. Yeah, Duno. Yo. He's like, Duno's texting me. No, if nobody you... comes that he wants to sit next to me. Bro. And then he and then Why are you saying it like they're fucking we're going to war? Yeah. Bro, he... you fucking shake and yeah. you're rubbing on my leg. I'm wearing yeah. sweats and I'm just getting my leg is getting that's hot. You're stupid, bro. And you're just like jittery. And okay, I'm like, okay. Bro, and it I is think hot, him knowing bro. that. It didn't have to be like that. Like he literally, like we had something in between us, but you came and took the space. Okay, you know what? F- you know where I fucked up because I'm thinking you guys are gonna be more fun, right? Than Vic. Just I, was, I was about to say the most ironic part about all of it. I it's had like, the role to yeah, myself, so. and I was like, "Dude, come here, fuck, Like I'm like, why cool. didn't you? Because he's a dick and he doesn't like me. <laughs> <laughs> no, Vic slept puts- the whole time. We got drunk. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so let me tell you, Lefty was like, "Yeah, we're gonna kick a fool." <laughs> Yeah. For six hours. Guess, no, oh, what, hi, what happened first? What happened first of all? We're gonna get was, drunk on the plush. No. Hell yeah. Yeah, yeah. What happened first of all was they tried to make me switch seats. They Maximo oh, tried, yeah, to we make, tried to make yeah. me. Ma- no, first. Maximo tried to make me go in the middle so that I was in between both those schools. <laughs> and I was like, hell no. I chose the window seat because yeah. I'm gonna knock out. This is my seat. Yeah, this is what not I chose. Yours. <laughs> You're not gonna make me suffer because Duno decided to switch over and then you wanted okay. more space. Okay, by the way, I was in like I was, if I was in a, like it's still in an IOC, but I was next to like two old, old ass people. people and we all know old people like they're just grumpy, like, mm. but I'm like, and I'm like, I prefer being uncomfortable with the homies than being uncomfortable with the yeah, facts, facts, facts. But I saw Vic, and Vic, I and when we went to London, Vic knocked out, like, mm. right away, too. I'm like, boring ass, I'm not trying to sit with this food. And then, but fucking Vic had all the snacks, way. Oh, yeah. I had Dude. all the snacks. Yeah. I tried to give y'all some. You guys forced me to eat them by I'm myself. I'm like, Vic, <laughs> stop throwing them across from Who's people. throwing them over the who, people? Who gives a fuck? <laughs> I have good aim. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> but I go sit next to We look reckless. <laughs> For sure. Bro, no, but shout out. Um, Terry. 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 Or stewardess. I'm not sure which one is the better... Terry. I think no, no, no. flight attendant. Flight attendant. I think okay. she's. A, I think she's a flight attendant. But bro, that shit. Okay, so then Letty was like, "Now, nah, Letty, the whole way." Because by the way, we have to walk 15 minutes to our fucking gate. Yeah. yeah. Letty like, yeah. airport is crazy. Letty was like, "Yeah, let's get drunk. We it's, ain't drunk. It's lit. It's lit." Yeah. And we're like, "All right." <laughs> we're all high. Yeah. Yeah. Four shot Letty on the plane. What? <laughs> <laughs> we should have got kicked out. Admit it. <laughs> but point is, Letty was like, "Yeah, fool, let's get, let's get lit." And we're like, "All right, bad, 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 bad." And and we tell Terry, she's like, "You're back." I'm like, "We're back." She's like. All right, this is what we're gonna do, and I'm like, she bet. was there on the flight. Yeah, on, on the flight there for us. Damn, it was that was crazy. Did someone was step that? on a dog? I know, that's what it sounded like. But point is, we're chilling, and Letty knocks out yeah. instantly. And then I'm like, I can go to sleep anywhere, You're anytime. You're also fucking this size. Me and yeah. Maxim are like battling. Like <laughs> people know the rules is like you the smallest. You're in the middle. No, that's not a rule. <laughs> that is a rule. That's it's not a rule. It's a rule. As the smallest. 
And to everybody in the smallest community, that's something you guys do to nah, make you feel better, but that's not good for us. I want to let you know. I want to let you know that PC never sits by the window. Okay, by, cho- by choice or because you force him? He's the smallest one. You know no. the rules. I, I, I always go. I always go to the passenger. I'm the biggest. No, and see, then you wonder why shorter people have the Napoleon complex and all that. Because they always have to sit in the middle. They this is my window. window. Yeah, and you, guys, <laughs> and you guys always push us around, and you guys all no. I chose this window seat. I'm gonna go. To sleep but, like but, I would, but it was funny because me and Maxi were like, I was like, I was like, we're to go to the middle, so we have more room, you know. Mm-hmm. And we're like, let's go to the middle. She's like, no. <laughs> and I'm like, you, I'm like, you stubborn little fucker. Yep. And then, and then I was gonna go sit with Vic, but I'm, I'd be like embarrassed about shit, like. I just don't want to walk to people and shit like that. And then by that time, some old lady came and sat there. She's like, can I sit here? I was like, fuck. Dude, I had the whole road to myself. Now you're stupid ass. So then, so then, you went and then, bro, me and Maximo just got late. Oh, and you guys are fake homies, by the way. Because apparently she went to go ask for me. Terry, she watched the pod and she's like, where's Rosecrans Vic? And you guys didn't. You guys didn't tell her where I was. Oh, we did. No, she was like, he's over there sleeping. Yeah, yeah. You're with your mouth open. open. You just point. You oh, just, he's over there. What the fuck does that your mean? Your mouth was wide open that sleeping. That doesn't mean anybody. So no. what? Yeah. And then, no, and you then, guys are fake homies. Fake. Right there. Give him a wine. He loves wine. No, yeah. bro, you don't bro, love wine. So you, you guys hella wine. drank wine. You guys bro, are gatekeeping. Bro, bro, me and Maximo got drunk as fuck. Mm-hmm. Yo, we <laughs> chugged one and we're like, yo, are you feeling it? He's like, I'm feeling me too. Oh. No, I wasn't. No, it, it was fun. It was funny because at some point, me and Maximo were, felt like we're the worst only ones up and we're just chopping it up, like just clowning. And then Terry walks by, she's like, and I'm like, oh, yeah, whatever he gets. By the way, you guys, Maximo mixes uh, Coca-Cola with wine. I don't know why. Sick yeah. fire. Sick red ass wine. wine. Takes the edge off. Red, red Takes the wine. edge off. Bro, let the, just know. Hey, I woke up and I was like, and we just started drinking. And then, she, and then you know, so we don't have the trash there because you don't have enough room to like, it's not like you can put your trash somewhere. Yeah. We're like, hey, fool, let's move this shit and get another one. But we took two, like, she gave us two big, like, we, before we took like three comes back to back I was lit watching Casino <laughs> yeah, I was like this stupid motherfucker get over that dumb ginger bitch oh, oh you were watching it <laughs> fucking ginger's a whore oh, she's okay. a super whore she's a fucking total scumbag fool but yeah, yeah I was watching it and then we woke up and Letty was like and then Letty had all the energy yeah, yeah. And she was like once I take my nap I'm like what's up and then we're kicking it and then yeah I'm about it but that's yeah was, we were kicking I wanted you guys to wake up you guys were both like, sleeping let's talk I'm like <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk. Yeah, yeah. She's like, I got energy now. I want to yeah. talk. Dude, like, it, it's funny because I look at the thing and we're barely like over. Like, yeah, I'm gonna say like Canada. Like, yeah, I like Canada. Like four hours left. And then Letty's like, yeah, nah, nah, yeah, nah. That shit's gonna be lit. Like, and I'm and we're yeah. not. And I wake up again and she's still thinking. She sees me open my eyes a little bit. I'm like, yeah, little <laughs> like, assholes. They were fake sleeping, so I don't think so. But bro, and then I we seen you the whole time, mouth open, pause. Yeah, yeah. I, I took I took a ZZZ quail. I took melatonin. <laughs> I was just you're just out. I was just out. I was bored. I was and you woke myself. up and had one more. And cup. then I was watching <laughs> Goblet of Fire. Mm. Oh, so good. And yeah. we're like telling this fool that he. I were I was watching Goblet of Fire and I was asking Duno all the questions. And I was in and out of sleep in between, so I would wake up and then they'd be, they. Had, and I was like, Professor McGonagall? And I was like, who is this? Oh no, who did he go to the dance with? And then, yeah, that like, shit was. Bro, uh, a fly would tell you like, poor about. Because I'm like a. a bro, like. That's like, why I hate the, like being the way like. Him, like he, he's fidgety. I swear to God, my, my right leg was like Hard. steaming hot. Mm. From his fucking <laughs> friction of just moving. I'm like, bro, oh, wearing sweats man. too. He likes you. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, shout yeah. out his shoulder. I ended up falling asleep on this yeah. shoulder. He's comfy. <laughs> that fool fucking, bro. I woke up and he... <laughs> I'm like, what's up, motherfucker? Like, oh, because no. I tried it and he moved. What a piece of shit on a dick. <laughs> but bro, the, the flight, the, that shit was... Was 10 funny. hours of, but that makes I me I think it's funny how Duno so sleeps how do I sleep oh I heard how you sleep yeah he puts the pillows on the TV oh yeah and he like, and I just put my head forward, forward. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like different people sleep differently like Max like this I'm like on the window and then Duno's like forward <laughs> bro it's cause bro I'm trying to get comfortable yeah. but, but when you're on the aisle you're like yeah. so they always like wake you up for some reason like oh, yeah. somebody taps you hits your arm and shit I was just oh, like bro yeah. it's over with but yeah I feel like Letty should have been a team player and got in the middle, but mm, she was... No. She I was thinking about myself. Hey, she was like, nah, fuck you, fool. Yeah. I'm out of here. Out of all the times I'm a team player, this is okay for me for a 10-hour flight to choose me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that shit was yeah. funny as fuck, but... Yeah, we're oh, Mexicans. We're, we're a bunch of beans. We are a bunch in of London. beans. In London. Shout are, out to us. Yeah, shout out to the Latinos in Londres. Yeah. Shout and out to also, oh. also Brown Pride, Brown, we're speaking of. Hey, shout, shout out, out to... The Fools and Medicina. 
<laughs> All right, Vic, you saw this first and you sent it to the chat. Yeah, so this is super dope. Uh, I originally, like, they have an Edgar-ish cut, but I know they're not Edgars. They're you know, not By Edgar's definition. For sure, yeah. um, but shout out to these two law-abiding citizens right here. Mm-hmm. Um, they're going to UCLA. Um, hold on. Wait. They're studying medicine. Yeah, they're studying medicine. Month, Jesus. To Sorry. The journey of two first-generation college students who, against all odds, are on the path to becoming <laughs> doctors. They call themselves the Foods and Medicine, and they become a social media. I love that. Station. Yeah. Carlos Grana has a story in tonight's All Good News. We're two foods. Thousands of scientists are showing us the Foods and Medicine. All right, shout out them, man. Shout, shout out the Foods and Medicine, man. Okay. It's cool. They're not nerds. They're not you know, nerds. And it's like, I'm sure there are well, other people nerds. are going to see them. They're, yeah, but they're like they look cool. Yeah, you know, yeah. like they're cool looking nerds. Because like we we know like some Latinos that have gone and yeah. on to be doctors and shit. You know, they're nerds. Like, yeah, they're nerds. I don't know any. Well, Cooking methamphetamine isn't a doctor, Vic. Well, yeah, yeah. It's a I mean, scientist. Scientist. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> I see like a whole movie after them. Like you know, like yeah. the Disney Pixar is gonna be after those. Because <laughs> <laughs> then we have the foods and medicine. I just love that they had the 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 lady from ABC say foods and medicine. Foods and medicine. Yeah. Yeah. That was like the best part. For that part. alone, yeah. Vibes. Yeah. But you know what? Shout I'm I'm like this is what I'm thinking, right? Because my mom, what, what we do as profession and shit like that, my mom thinks I could just call anybody. Like my mom, like oh yeah, Gloria Trevi was aquí. Can you like interview her? I'm like mom. Mom, that's not the way that works. Yeah. So imagine these fools. What? So imagine the fucking ground. Grandpa backward, oh, me yeah. arreglar la espalda. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, hey, that's not the way that works. A lot of free work. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, they're gonna, he's gonna have to set what up like a home clinic. What area of medicine do you think that they that they are gonna be experts in? Food. <laughs> <laughs> they're gonna be podiatrists? Yeah, podiatrists. Yeah. Oh, that's they're a word? They're gonna be food doctors. Yeah. Oh, yeah. food doctors. Food. 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 Oh, I definitely met a, what's it, what is it called? Podiatrist. Podiatrist. When I got shot. Oh. A podiatrist checked my bones in my foot. Mm. <laughs> and was like, you're going to be okay, but if you want us to take out the whole bullet, we got to take off your... And then he had a name for my big toe. Yeah. <gasps> what if you... What? I don't know. Stuff used a big word. Like, I didn't know these cars were phalanges. You took it, you took it out? Yeah. No, I think I have my big toe still. If not, I'll be unbalanced. Oh, no, okay. the bullet. <laughs> no, some of the fragments are still there. Oh, wow. that's right. Sure. You want to feel it? Feel it. No wonder Come you're on. talking fragments. No, no, on the other side. In the bottom of the right there. Pinch Full it. like this. Okay. Full like this. Hey, listen. Let's say you walk into no. the to the... And these fools are the doctor. You walk in for a physical. Oh, and if I have to check my balls? Yeah, you have to check. You have to cough. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to walk in. Like, no mom is way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bring the other fool. Yeah. For where in Westwood, not fucking the county jail. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no, they make you quick. cough. Oh, when they put the thing behind your back? No, boys, don't they make you guys cough in They in just put like the little... No. That, they put the little sound thing on your back and go like cough if you like your breathing right or your lungs are oh, right. Oh, yeah. No, they check your breathing. But even they, down there, for the boys, they do that. I don't. Maybe think, when you're younger, I, mean, I don't. I don't. I don't think I've done that as an adult. When they make you pick up your balls, squat, and cough. Oh, I don't mean all of that. That's <laughs> when you. Nah, they've never made me cough anywhere. Good. Have you yeah. gone to forget a physical? So yeah, 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 yeah. What happens in the physical? Back there. For a physical, they make you. They for they make your blood work. Mm-hmm. I think you get your blood work. They check your weight, your height. They check like if you like. Do guys have? What girls have as gynecologists? Like, do we do we have gynecologists, which is all about the little yeah. chiva area? Uh huh. Do guys have ball doctors? Yeah, I don't think so. I think there's some they, type no, of they, ball they, doctor. They, they 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 tell you to. That's what you like, guys are missing. Feel, they feel your testicles and How? then you feel any Whoa. like. You, <laughs> They tell you like they tell us to fill your testicles and then yeah. you feel like any like weird any lumps? bumps or yeah. lumps, that's when you you Okay, bring let's it say up. you feel a weird lump. Then we fucking let them know. Let yeah. them know. And, and then these lump. guys walk in the room. Oh. <laughs> hey homie, you're good? Yeah. yeah Ooh, probably you got lumpy number. balls or what? <laughs> yeah, I don't know how I feel about them foods like having the 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 troca, like like, I feel like if you're a doctor, you should be driving like a Prius. Oh, my God. They have mamalonas and shit. They have mamalonas. Yeah. They skirt That's... off after work. They what? drive into the hospital with peso pluma in the, <laughs> I mean, Wait, the like, radio. Do your guys' doctors check your vagina and your physicals? Girls' doctors? Yeah, every we have to take pap smears. Well, pap smear is like they stick something and they go test it to make sure that we're good. Oh, damn. Mm-hmm. I don't think and with then the when guys you're is pregnant, out. it's mm-hmm. always down there like to check yeah. how the baby's forming all that good A lot stuff. of maintenance. Oh yeah. shit. We got a lot of maintenance. So it's yeah. weird to me that for our maintenance, you guys are just like, hey, what's up? You doing good? Yeah, I'm, I'm good. All right, cool. No, yeah. you said, yeah, check your balls, check your. Like you straight food? Yeah, straight yeah I'm cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're good. I, what about you guys knowing that sooner or later, one day, you're going to have to have like a colonoscopy? Oh, the butt thing? Yeah. With the finger? No. I don't know, I don't know what that is. Whoa. Wait, That's a thing. You got a finger in your butt? Yeah. No, you have to get Whoa. a. Somebody. I don't know. Isn't, LV, you're old. Let me know. <laughs> <laughs> it's a thing. It's a thing. You know 
what I'm talking about. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. But you got it. I haven't got it. It's not your finger. It's not a finger, though. It's a thing. It's not old, bro. It's a thing. I thought it was like a tube. No, but you have to do a test. Uh, uh, a colonoscopy. Uh, it's a similar, but it's... um. Yeah, yeah that, but that's all they, guys they have to the, have that sooner or later. That's where they send like the camera down your butt or whatever, right? I don't know. I just know, guys, when you're old, you have to do that shit. There's a thing where you have to like... Oh, that's shit. So when you're uh, above 40, yeah. they they have to do some like, sort of test. Like we as women have to look forward like, oh, we got to give birth. You guys, oh, the, that freaking hose got to go up our... Yeah. Up our ass. One that's day. Watch well, it's a test. Hold on. Anyway, shout out to Food and Medicine. <laughs> <laughs> cool or culo. Okay, some people over in Japan love, love, love our music. They love Valentin Elizalde so much so that they've actually translated his song yeah. into Japanese and it sounds like a vibe. Check this out. Yeah, they translated, really? his, it, his, they translated his yeah. lyrics. Come on, sing it, man. The lyrics are right there. That has yeah, to they be did this AI. With AI. Yeah, that has to because it's his Dog, voice. It sounds still. so good. Are right, you gonna pause it? All right, stop it. By the way, great fucking song. Yes, so and I like how they put Goku and Valentina Lizarre in the same photo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they translated his song into Japanese, fool. Yeah, I couldn't tell. The it sounds so good that yeah. yeah, that's the thing. When I first heard it, I'm like, is that his real song or mm -hmm. is it? Is it AI? No, it sounds incredible. Yeah. I just love that like our culture spreads like right. further and further. Why well, know when I why well, I know in Japan the the cholo culture has always been big yeah. out there. Huge. Yeah. Like huge out there. I remember like like with the Mystical Ponies and then they used to travel out there and just yeah, fucking go still, do big ass shows. Super huge. And low riding culture is huge. The low out riding, there. the tattoo culture. Yeah. Um, even like the, the the style of dressing with like the the, the high yeah. socks, the dickies. Mm -hmm. We went it was crazy when I want to go see. Santa Fe Clan at the Belasco was it last year I went with my mom. There was like a group of like foreigners that were there to see that perform. Oh, that's tight. Yeah. And I'm like, what the fuck? And he's like, yeah, bro. He's like, we're and they love Psycho Round. Oh. Like, and I was like, oh, that's fucking dope. That's super crazy. That's fire though. By the way, um, you know how we're having the debate about Peso Pluma a couple episodes ago? Yeah. About like what's his name versus like the band name. Yeah. And someone, we're all like looking at the different references. Someone actually hit it on the head with it's like Santa Fe Clan. We think the guy is Santa Fe Clan. They're all Santa Fe Clan. Yeah, they're all Santa Fe Clan. Yeah. He's Angel from Santa yeah. Fe Clan. But like he took on the name because it's like, I don't not he wasn't even the first one or the oldest member. He's probably like one of the newer or youngest ones. But he's like the kind face of, of it. He's the face. Oh, or like Limbiscuit. No, because I know Fred Durst. Yeah, but like secondary. I knew Limbiscuit as the bat. Band. You knew the other members? No, I knew it as the band. When yeah. I said Limp Bizkit, I thought of the band. I didn't think of a person. I thought of him, and then I found out that his name was Fred Durst, like, after. Yeah. But I was young. So. But yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. But yeah, shout out to the Japanese, man. Yes. Is it cool or cool or it's cool as fuck? Super cool. Yeah. cool as fuck. Super fucking cool. All right, let's get into Rate the Rom Flom. Rate the Rom Flom. Rate the Rom All right, we have a few Rom Flas that we want to show off, and so we're going to rate them. And then I also have a celebrity Rom Fla at the end of it all, okay? Uh, a celebrity Rom Fla. Yeah, celeb Rom Fla. Okay, these are all user submitted. It's a fool that's on a oh, motorcycle, shit. but also has roller skates on, roller blades on. Okay, the homie's on 10 wheels right now. <laughs> He's on oh, a lot of wheels. Oh, shit. That is not safe, bro. It's not safe. <laughs> Fucking suicidal. Yeah, but that dude, head ass. <laughs> Bro, what if he wants so like the, the head start with the motorcycle and then when he gets off, he's still going? Oh, my God. Oh, I get God. what you're saying. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, he, so well, this will walk the, the like motorcycle this. go. You know what it is? <laughs> and you know what it is? He probably gets cramps. And like, 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 if his legs are like, like sitting back, like how people oh, ride their motorcycles. Oh, how they ride their bikes. So he probably bikes. rides his he motorcycle like that. But he also can't dangle his legs because it might get hurt on the road. Exactly. So he got yeah. motorcycle. So he, he got motorcycle legs. He got <laughs> rollers. He, he got roller no airplane legs. Oh, yeah. wait, it says right there. What? He's disabled, and the skates help him keep the bike up when he stops. I posted a photo outside of the the Chivas America game, and there was like a guy pushing a cart saying, "What's up?" And then there's so many comments. They're like, "That's actually that's me. me. That's yeah. actually my cousin. That's yeah. actually so and so." And it's like, "No, you're liars." <laughs> that's fucking crazy. Mm -hmm. But if he is that's handicapped, cool. shout out to him for being creative, bro. He's not <laughs> handicapped. There's no handicap placard anywhere on him. Yeah, I don't shit. think you can ride a bicycle. And I mean, yeah. why would you ride a motorcycle if you're handicapped? Yeah, yeah I don't think you can. Because then if you crash, you won't feel it. No. <laughs> <laughs> What do we rate this? <laughs> what do we rate this? You gotta have two tragic accidents. 
Hurry up so we can move ten on. Ten for uh, ten wheels. Yeah, ten for ten wheels. I give it cool too. It's <laughs> cool, it's cool, cool, cool. Oh shit! I give it a ten. Okay, next, <laughs> next round, bro. <laughs> Okay, Whoa. another motorcycle game. I like, see, I like this. Oh, okay, that's this fucking is for sure dope. customization. Wow, it's half motorcycle, half truck. Yo, that's for the so ladies. This is a truck convenient. bed that's on the motorcycle. Yes. That's wow. fine. I like this. That shout out this fool. Shout out him being creative. Because if, let's say he gets extra more creative and yeah. puts some fucking, takes off the top of the head, of the of the bed, right? Like yeah. the truck bed. And you put some seats back there, some seat belts. Yeah. We're rocking and rolling. We outside like you, baby. Yeah. Yeah. True. I just see my kids jumping around back there. And I always think of those overhead views of like the people the, in the work trucks that are laying down oh, yeah. on the bed. It's like they could chill back there. That's what I'm saying. I'm a- this would be dope. Imagine that they had like a like a taxi cab kind of service like this in Mexico. Yeah. I would love that. Or it'd be cool if the back turned should- into like a little camp, little like a little room. Ooh, so that you can just pull camper? over. Camper? Ooh. I'm not mad at Jeez. it. I'm, I'm not mad at it, but I don't love it as much as the 10-wheeler thing. So I'm <laughs> yeah. going to give it like a 7 out of 10. I'm going to give it a 9.5. Okay. I'm going to give I'm going to like a 7. Yeah. Because I'm thinking about like... Yeah. Like this was probably driving somewhere in Alabama. Yeah, facts. And you know, maybe we can't bump us a blue mile while we're driving. Yeah, But we I, I still like the creating it. Yeah. And it's not ugly. It's not like, oh, I like... So we're still clowning on this yeah. food, but it's, it's, it's not bad. Yeah. yeah. It's not bad. Okay, and next up is a celebrity Ramfla. It is the Ramfla of... Is this Ben Simmons? Oh, Devin Booker. Devin, Devin Booker. Booker. Devin Booker. Devin Booker's Ramfla that he pulls up to his games in, which is pretty tight, you guys, not going to lie. That's fire. Wow. Shout out Devin Booker because yeah. he's a huge car guy. And he's half Mexican, right? He is, but also he's from the Detroit area. Okay. And, you know, that's big car culture over there, too. Um, Damn, that's so, so tight. I'm, I'm guessing both of his, you know, Mexican side and Detroit side combined... And he's big into cars, and this is fire. That is tight. It needs a paint job, or is it supposed to be like that? I think that's how he wants it. Yeah. Like, kind of rustic look. Um, but he has crazy car collection. Yeah. yeah. So this is just the latest one that he pulled up to his games in. And, and you know what? Devin Booker, you need to have, like, Mr. Cartoon design your next, like, shoe mm. or something. Because that'll be fire. Because yeah. he's because he understands the culture. Like, I yeah. think, like, even though, obviously, like, you know, he's an NBA player, he would probably raise... More on his um, black side, but mm-hmm. Latinos, if you come and brace us over here, yeah. we're going to love you forever. We don't, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. He's I'm gonna, figure he's, out what he's kind of car is that? He's going to be a Lakers soon. Chevy, a Chevy. Sure. It's a Chevy. Yeah, no, but like what, what kind I of car? I think it's a truck, truck, but they, they dropped it. They, they, they probably they, cut the springs and then put like low pros on it. So it That's just fire car. though. Yeah. yeah. That's cool. It's I'm like, going to give it a 9 out of 10 just because he's not a Laker yet. Yeah. But like he'll, when he's a Laker, it'll be 10 out of 10. He'll be a Laker. I want to say like in two years. Damn, you think when he's a Laker and he pulls up in his cars, all the other, like LeBron has to step his car game up. Oh, LeBron will be gone by then. Oh. Off the team. He's not going to be a Laker, guys. Sorry. He is. Devin's not going to be a Laker? Bro, I, think, totally, I think he'll bro, be a Laker. He's he said he's going to be a Laker soon. He's a so Kobe So you say disciple. LeBron's going to be out soon? Like in two years? Yeah. Wow. So the thing is, okay, so right now, obviously, he has a really good team with um, with the Suns. He has um, Bradley Beal, and then he has KD. But there's no leadership on that team, so it's going to fold. It's going to implode. It's going to be nasty. It's going to be like the Nets a couple seasons ago. And then LeBron is going to play mm-hmm. another year or two because you know he's in really good condition right now. But... After that, AD is going to need a, a partner. And he's still only going to be like 27, 28. Perfect time. Come to Lakers. Come home, baby. And guess Woo! what? Wow. And guess what? They went to Kentucky together. Kentucky. Yes, exactly. Um, there's fried chicken there. Yeah. Because <laughs> um, you know how like even with the Laker players and just basketball players, they show their outfits or them walking in? Yeah, the yeah. tunnel. The photos are going to start even earlier, like from yes. when they pull in. Oh. Everybody's going to have to step their car. Yep. Right. Bro, this fo- and, and I can only imagine, like, let's say it does come. All the lower clubs are like, yeah, fool, let's go. Welcome this fool. Yes. Oh, and that'd be tight. And, uh, fool, Mexican, Don't, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Fix that's going to be right there with his car club? Yes. <laughs> Hell yeah. Um, speaking of Latino athletes, shout out to Caleb Sanchez. Yay. Hey. Hey. Shout out to Caleb. Yeah. They smoked them. Bosco beat... Modern day. Modern, Modern day. day. Wow, they beat the number one... Yeah, he left them at zero. Yeah, Don't and then Caleb nasty. Sanchez, who's half Filipino, half Mexican, Salvadorian. or Salvadorian. Sal- Salvadorian. Sorry, half yeah, Filipino, yeah, yeah. half Salvadorian. He's the one that kind of like led the charge for Bosco as far as um, yes. quarterbacks. Damn. The charge, man. Shout out uh, his pops. You were there. I was yeah. there. I went. Um, his family welcomed me with open arms. Like, I literally fire. stood with his dad and uncle the whole game. No way. Wow. Yeah, and the whole family. And That's it was like fire. a gang of them. It was Salvadorians on one side and then like the Filipinos. And he had like. You a, met his mom? Everybody. What? How's his mom? His mom was like super anxious. She was like, I'm nervous. I can't watch the game. Aww. I can't watch the game. And it was really Why cool just seeing 
like how much of his family was there. It, it, right. And then after you saw little kids run up to him asking for his autograph, and it was just really dope to That's see. Hella dope. Where did he go to college? Um, I, I don't know. Uh, he has some offers, but I don't know which ones. Yeah. He's a senior? Yeah, senior. He's a senior. Yep. And, and he hasn't decided? This is his first year uh, starting. starting. That's he's why. getting a lot of offers too. Oh, it's his first year starting. Yep. Yeah. Okay. And for what he's doing out that first year. Shout out him, right? Yeah. yeah. Shout out him. But and who knows? I don't think it's his bad that it's his first year starting. I think it's the school's bad. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, but is he getting the looks? Yes. That yes. He's yeah, getting he the just, looks? They just beat Modern I mean, day, they, they like, beat him. But what I'm saying is like, he also surrounded by really great players. Yes. Right. They so really what I'm saying is like, is he being overlooked or you think you think nah, he his stats are really good? I think he's just new. Yeah, but he only has one year. A lot so of the, like, yeah, a lot so, of so it's gonna be scary for colleges to really reach out. Yeah. But they're gonna see his potential off of that one year. Mm -hmm. And he has a size. And he's gonna too. be fresher. Intangibles. I'm just saying. I'm just. I'm just like. And I'm the just... thing is too now with the transfer portal, where he goes first might not be where he ends up later. He might go mm -hmm. to like a smaller school mm -hmm. at first, potentially, then end up at like a Washington or. Well, because they were just number nine, and when they won this game, they're either two or three now. So. <laughs> His rank, like his value goes up. Oh, yeah. And yeah. then what he does in CIF, we'll see. Yeah. Do your I shit, man. Los frijoles? <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Sanchez and the family, man. Shout out to everybody. Okay, Armando, and big everybody. up Angie. Get over here, baby girl. Sobresala, Angie. Sobresala. Angelica. Angelica. Angie. 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 Um, we all heard the new Bad Bunny, right? Yeah. Did yeah. you guys like it? Are you guys still listening to it right now? No. Uh, you know what? Okay, yeah. I thought. Okay, it's not growing on me. It's yeah. not growing on me. You no. didn't like it because everyone was really excited that it was Trap Bad Bunny. Yeah. 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 Offset's album is better than Bad Bunny's say, album yeah. and Drake's yeah. album. Offset's yeah. album is better than Drake's album. Offset's yeah. album is really good. Yeah. Better than Drake's album. Yeah. I mean, Drake's. I feel and like it was like the hype coming out, and then it came out, and then it's just like I'm gonna revisit it soon, but right now I'm not stuck. You know what it is? This is all Bad Bunny. Yeah, this is Trap Bad Bunny. This bad bunny kinda, with the eye. Kind of. This bad bunny with yeah. the eye. Why? That was just rich and super famous now. Yeah, and now he's dissing and he's, everyone. He's like a that's villain what I don't now. Like. Yeah. Yes. Do that's you, what I'm going to get into. That's right, Perrito, come from the trenches. That's what you're supposed to do. Do what? it up. This, this is like him friends? when he was rapping with Arcanel. Yeah. He was talking that shit. He was dissing people? Yeah. He when, was when, dissing. When, he, when he was coming out. Bad Bunny's old music videos with Arcanel, they in the slums of Puerto Rico. Okay, that's yeah. one thing, but dissing people. Yeah, he was doing it then. Who he was, was throwing it shots. Back then? I think back then, probably like the locals around him and shit like that. Oh. He, he, was, he was just doing like ghetto shit. Like, you know, like. like no, being ghetto and doing the hood shit, all of that's different yeah. than dissing people. No, what I'm saying is, Dan, fucking, that's the energy he came with. That's what I'm saying. Because like, this reminds me more of Drake. And Drake to me is not really gangster. It's just dissing. No, and, no, and a yeah. lot of name dropping. Name That's what dropping. he did like a lot in this yeah, album. This, yeah. But um, see, but I think he he reached the level that he wanted to be at to do that. Like he's like, I'm bigger than everybody now. But I don't like that he did J Belvin. Like that was unnecessary. All right, let's get into it. The Carol G does his own. Oh, he, he, he said he wanted to make out with Tokisha. Carol G. Wait, he just this JLP? Yes. What'd he say? So, oh, so on the on Telefono well, it's a reach, it's a reach but, I don't but, know but if I'm it's with you, but I'm with you. Because he said on that song, he said, um, song? who wears, is the, can you click on it, Jose? This part. So 2024, you can pause it. So 2024. 2024, who the hell wears Psycho Bunny? And then, What's Psycho and then, Bunny? Psycho, Psycho Bunny, Bunny is a brand. So, so then, so then JLP did. What Psycho, Psycho Bunny? Psycho Bunny. Psycho Bunny. Psycho Bunny. Psycho Bunny. Bad Bunny used to wear it a lot. No, no, no. no. Never? No. Where's that? Okay, I got you. Because I seen it in Puerto Rico. I got you. Team, you team work yeah, for you get it. Yeah, yeah. Where's the real prices yeah. right here? Well, I know what lyric he's referring to. Okay, so Puerto Rican. <laughs> yeah, yes, but he's dissing more people. But, 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 but we know okay. what we're talking about. So Psycho Bunny, Narcos Love It. It's kind of like one of those things that we're like, yep. it's the brand. But J.O.P. talked about it. And Psycho uh, Bunny. Oh, 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 yeah. 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 That's what he meant. That's exactly where he started. And the then, song. so he's like, he's like, it's 2024. Who the fuck with Psycho Bunny? But the oh. first of all, it's 2023. Next year, I mean, next he's year. talking about next yeah. year. Like, oh, he's definitely dissing him then. Yes. Yeah. I think he's trying to diss. Yeah. Throwing shade. Because also Not that just song, him, that's how almost like everybody. The region, like, that's how like the regional. right? Yeah. Uh, no, it's the Kwame. Oh, Teco Mem. Yeah. Oh, so sure? he, he Tecumem should be aware of that song. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, because they're probably one of his. Competition in that round when it comes to just, just like, Latin, Latin, not, not Latin Latin region, but the Latin, Latin and the charts. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah mm -hmm. for sure, for sure. Ooh. 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 Yeah. Yeah. What if that's the reason why? What if Bad Bunny's the reason why Four Star Hida was not nominated for Ooh. Grammys? Latin Grammys. I don't he know. He has that type of power. Was Bad Bunny nominated? Yeah. 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 
Nah, just those people don't know anything. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I mean, and we have that problem, like we said, every year with the Grammys. Right. Yeah, but, I, but but he's definitely throwing shit. I, you know what? I paid attention to this one because I'm a If it's huge... one thing I've learned from like watching a bunch of stories about narcos is you don't diss them. No, you don't. You don't. But you'll F around and find out. Yeah. It's that yeah. chart. <laughs> so, they, so they dissed. So, okay, let's just say, right? He dissed for that. No, but... let's just say he did. Okay, he did. He did literally to JLP. Yeah, like don't say I. Think. I don't know no, any it, other song that says, that Psycho, says Bunny, Psycho Bunny, like, and in the charts and mainstream like that. So essentially, that's repping it, right? Fuerza Rey, I gotta go come back home. This is like oh, yeah. similar to back in like the Mystery '90s where there was only so many, uh, so many rappers. This is Babe. And it was like, oh, yes. I you're always talking to yeah. somebody in the yeah. realm, right? Mm-hmm. This reminds mm-hmm. me of that. No, it's like if you mention a certain thing, you know. The exact person you're talking exactly, about. Yeah. Yeah. You don't have to you know what I'm saying? So you, yep. just, you, you know. You, you know, like if I were to say something, something about Fendi, I know that freaking Nikki always wears Fendi, so I'm, like, yep. I'm dissing her yeah. or whatever. Yeah. Um, you know who's attached to certain brands. Facts. Mm-hmm. And Psycho Bunny, we know that for JOP. Exactly. So if he says, who the fuck is wearing Psycho Bunny still? Damn. Yeah. Imagine yeah. they just sacred, Maximum. Um, what are you doing if they just say <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the shout out. <laughs> yeah. Okay, but this is one which I think that's this, one this of probably them. probably the most surprising one, right? It is a very shocking one. Oh, the, the one that was shocking. No, yeah, because I did not want to believe it when he well, says, uh, it. Vuelve, "No, no, no, not 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 on this one." So the, on the diss track, it's a uh, "Vuelve Candy B." Mm-hmm. That's where he's saying, um, "You can click on it, Jose." Mm-hmm. That's where he's saying, "Like I'm from Puerto Rico, where the real beach are, are from." from. Oh, yeah. Yeah. is that really a diss no, though? As, yes. yes. Cause, Who else cause uses the Okay, can he I can I just where that the, the term came from? Yeah, no, no, no. Can I also insert just like just my take off disses and hip hop and all of that? The subliminals are perfect because they make people say, "Was that really or is it a reach?" It's like their way of dissing someone, mm-hmm. but also saying keeping their hands clean. Without taking accountability. Yeah, yes. exactly. So he, it's not a direct where they where he says, yeah. "I don't like Carol G," but he's gonna diss her in a way where we're all like, "Is he dissing her?" But he's not. But she actually isn't Puerto yeah. Rican. But so it's like the this is where subliminals thrive. This is. Like top tier Drake shit. This is why Drake, yeah. Jay Z is a subliminal artist. He'll mm-hmm. say something about you, yeah, yeah, yeah. but then he could also be like, "That wasn't about you." Oh, but if the shoe fits, it's wear. But if yeah. you yeah. wear bad, then just wear yeah. it or whatever. It starts a conversation. Yeah, yeah, but also it's like it makes it more like you're bad versus me actually For like you showing it, you yeah. like I pulled the trigger on mm-hmm. you. It's like, uh, um, so it definitely feels uh, like a because we all know Carol G as La Bichota. Yeah, yeah La Bichota yeah. Right. and That's Carol definitely- G. Uh, bichota, bichota is the original bichota word. Bichota season. Bichota is the original word that came from Puerto, Puerto Rico. Rico. Mm-hmm. Ed uh, Carol G has acknowledged saying like, you know what, that word it taught uh, Anuel taught it to me. Like, yeah. I know that's a Puerto Rican song. Uh-huh. I mean, word that Anuel and I Anuel mean, is Puerto Rican. And yep. Anuel is Puerto yes. Rican who so, called her bichota. Yeah, and so and then she embraced it fully. Yeah. she flipped the bichota and put it as bichota and pretty much created the own. And then everybody was like, <laughs> <laughs> but it's like, why, why does Carol G of all? Of all yeah. people, fool. I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why. Because she's Colombian. Person, yeah, person. You're hanging okay. out with Arcangel way too much. <laughs> that part. Oh. All right, there. That's it. Yeah, that's that's it. Um, you don't think so. I didn't want to believe it? Fuck it. Do your shit, bad fuck. money. But you know why? But you know why? I feel like he's doing this because I feel like it's like in a. Like he, yeah, he's he's playing the media game. Yeah, like, like he doesn't need to. Like, don't go after Carol G. And then Drake have his men, either. have her men on that album, Dad, and still did. sample yeah. her on the beginning of that song. Well, we don't know I if that's her man either. I think he's trying to hey, so- solidify that he's like the oh. biggest Latin artist. He's letting his nuts hang. Yep. But goes putting after shit on the table, girl? like yo. If anything, they should have collabed. Yeah. But happen. that's why I'm saying I did not want to believe it because I'm like, you have her men on that album, on Perro Negro. You have that X Men. We don't know if they're still together. Well, I mean, after this, I guess. Yeah. It's probably not like, oh my god, you ran an album. Yeah. yeah. And he didn't tell me you he guys were partying me? together. He you was, didn't hear it. You sampled listening. me. Was yes, they were partying in together. Rico. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out Fade. All right, now Bro, this yeah. one. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 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 All right, but let's go to this one right here. All right, but the one that everyone was talking about right away was the disc to J Balvin, which I was like, why? This part. <laughs> What do you say? He He's, says like I I've been with the same ones like since well, my day ones. Day, my, day yeah. ones. I'm not everybody's friend like J Balvin. Yeah, yeah. J Balvin yeah. caught and a he, That for was his no last reason. bar. That was his last yeah. bar on the song. So it was yeah. just like the. Oh my Balvin, like boom. I'm but not, J Balvin said, 
Jay Balvin responded back and he yeah. was just like in shock saying like, you know what? This is not the person that I know of. We make great music. You change, bruh. He looks he really wants to cry. Of course. Because, pause it. So what he said is like, you know, like, I don't understand it, but the guy I know, mm-hmm. yeah, the bad a, bunny I know is a good guy. Yeah. yeah and so he, I don't know why he's doing this, but. And then he answered and says, you know what? I, ju- I wish him well. I wish his album sells out. out. Like, things like that. Just being positive. Being yeah. J Balvin. Because again, he, said he did not expect that. He's a, he's a good shit. artist and all this. Yeah, he was just, mm-hmm. he took the high road, really. I feel bad for J Balvin, honestly. Yeah. Yeah. He's yeah. been, he's been taking, see. like, he's been Ooh. honestly, like, going after it. the Residente thing. Yeah. It looks like the whole like Latin scene in, 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 kind of flipped on him. Flipped on him. Well, oh, well yeah. it's because look, fool. At the end of the day, you knew what you were doing. Like, bro, fool, calle trece, fool. Like yeah, that, was, okay. that was no, a road, no, no. that was a road that you should have never took. No he matter didn't bro. Start it. he didn't take it. He, he didn't he start said it. something about the Grammys and then Calle Trece dude yes. came in. Residente Residente came in. So he, he didn't start off. beef with with Residente. Yeah. No, he didn't start it with the Grammys. But he egged it on. And then when he did the hot well, dog merch, well, not he it on. He probably like, like he tried to flip, he tried it, to flip the, it, yeah, which anyone would want to do, right? But but you also, unfortunately, he has to realize like the Jay Bobby's scene, not the Puerto scene Rican, right? No, Jay no. Bobby's yeah. Colombian. So, okay, 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 okay. But then. so it feels like Bad Bunny is going against a lot of the Colombians because yes. Carol G's Colombian, yeah, but Faith Colombian is Colombian. So but you know, but you know what it is Colombian. too. That is kind of like one of those. It's kind of one of those things where behind the scenes we all know that. Residente is like OG to all of them, right? Whether yeah. whether he's the biggest artist or not, right? Whether yeah. he's yeah, which humongous, mm-hmm. he's also Puerto Rican. Yeah. And I feel like when the wave was being paid, when somebody was putting off of Puerto Ricans, it was in. Mm-hmm. So to the Anuels, to all of them fools, he's That's their the legend. OG. OG. Yeah. So yeah. no matter what he does, whether he was right or wrong, we're gonna take this full side. Like then, like yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So so right or wrong, he's he's this is our OG right here. Mm-hmm. Fuck the rest of these fools. Mm-hmm. You food are Colombian. You food probably think you're, yeah. you're better than us because you know, like whatever situation. You know what right. I'm saying? Yeah. It's kind of similar to like agree. And like, that's all. But if I have a personal relationship with you, which yeah, yeah. Bad Bunny did, and made albums with you, and has praised you, and great said like album. you know, yeah. great he, album. He's the Love one that. that when no one was looking at me, he was checking for me. He was propelling me to the mainstream because yeah. yeah. Residente didn't do that for Bad Bunny. Nope. J Balvin well, did. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And so into the pop culture. So if yeah. he does that yeah, for you, that's why this was tripping. Is like I understand that they can't like maybe publicly support me, but then. Don't also have to publicly diss me. Just yeah. like that, you know? No, no, they're all they're all different points of view, so I get them, but it is it is, and I totally forgot they had a great album together. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like I feel like I feel like one of my yeah. favorite. Yeah. 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 I had sex with us on the first day I heard it. Damn. I don't want to have that. The first time I heard it, I yeah. fucked to it. I was like, dude, I got to fuck to this. Yeah, that's crazy. You paused it? To your ex or right, something? You know what's crazy? About. <laughs> Is I think when Bad Bunny had that whole phone throwing situation. Yeah. Remember, we were like, dude, something's yeah. up with him. Like, he's probably going through something. And this feels like what he created while he's been, was going. Like, I still feel like he's going through something. Yeah. Like, uh, he's it's, not in it's his first. It's, it's the, the, it's the curse. Oh. It's and he also curse. said like, w- like no curse works on me or whatever. Yeah. I'm gonna keep it a buck. Ed. When I saw it, I was like, oh my god, we're gonna get a little winner album. Mm-hmm. That's Same. what I was feeling like. Koto vibe, yeah. like like kind of like that album we had with Jay Balvin. Yeah, oh, I, I was expecting that album. Mm-mm. We got this mamada, which is good. I feel yeah. it. <laughs> and you know what? Like the poet in them, he works with a lot of like Salvadorans in them, and they like trap, like trap yeah, Spanish yeah, music. Yeah, yeah. Bro, they love it. Yeah, to yeah. Them, it's not but bad. to me, it's not bad. It's, it's, it's not but bad. It's just, not what we're used to, and we did not like any of the distance it's that all, he needed. It's not on him, if, and, and, and even if, and, but but Bad Bunny, let's be honest, fool, you had already figured out your recipe. You weren't booming when you were doing the trap shit. Yeah. No. You yeah. were booming when you when you took this route, and it was amazing. And, and you, you don't have to be scrambling. But, but even in the uh, in the lyrics and, and overall, he has said that this album isn't really for anybody. He doesn't care who this album it's is for. for. Him. Yeah. It's for him. Yeah, that's he wanted to get that's it off what his every, chest. Like, every project. Like hope, like understanding, like if you don't like it, at least I like it. But yeah. as they should, yeah. it's, it's music. But yeah. then, it's then you, you didn't keep it in your library for a reason. True, you didn't right. keep you know it in I'm, your house for a reason. Yeah. You sent it to the world. Fact. And mm-hmm. f- f- you know what I'm thinking too? That the, f- they're gonna interview him and, and he's gonna be like, "Nah, for those songs are old." Yeah, like I like, like they're old songs. That's not name. what I meant. You guys are taking yeah. it out of context. Um, That's yeah. what he's gonna say. What this showed me is that I'm not a real bad bunny fan because I'm definitely a fan of that one album. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I was yeah. fucking bumping the fuck out of that. So for me and all the rest of the people that jumped on there, yeah, or maybe for like the the hits like uh, Perea Sola and all that stuff, yeah. mm-hmm. to hear this, I'm like, all right, where's the, where's Titi? Oh, so now, oh see, oh see, so now. 
the real fans are gonna come out. No, yeah. see, I like yeah. it, but I also I thought like the Trap Bad Bunny was also a little more emo Trap Bad Bunny. This so is it was like, a lot more like <laughs> it was like heavy towards like relationship, yeah. like love, but it was still like trap or like player shit. Like this shit is just a lot more like lyric, like yeah, like which fucking, is cool, which is cool. cool. Do your I shit, don't mind but, it. I don't yeah. mind it. but 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 I damn, I totally I don't have know for- that lyric, but definitely shots. Because I well, haven't he heard anyone bars. be like, "What? What's the bar then?" All I hear is people talking about the disses. People the aren't be like, "This yeah. bar." Him saying that he fucked uh, Kanzo in one of the sisters' yeah. houses, all that stuff. To me, yeah. that's just like. But also, deep. but also, when he's we think bars, he's yeah. yeah. One line thing line I've learned too. about guys is when they get into this bag, that they're going through something. Yes, that's what uh, I feel. Mm-hmm. Like, you know what? That's why I'm probably why I'm not listening to it too much. Because I don't. You can relate. No, I don't feel that like that negative kind of. Yeah, he's in a negative space. I'm not on that vibe right now. Who would you compare? Maybe, but like if you could compare it, like yeah, it sounds a lot like for all the dogs. No, no. What I'm saying is like if you could compare this album to like like a hip hop album, like Drake. No, but other than Drake, other than Drake, other than Drake, no one. But Drake, he's Uh, he's being very Drake. He's in his Drake bag. They probably kick it with the other. Maybe a future when he get when he got heartbroken. I don't see like Future. Mode? No, because Future was Disney. still like high. Like, Future is still like the a guy's guy. He feels yeah. like he's even going against dude. Like how are you gonna Your go friends. against JOP? Yeah, I think how, how are you gonna, gonna go, go against, against Balvin? J Balvin? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Carol G. that sucks. Like, but Damn, it's, poor it's Bobby, a, that food. That yeah, food Bobby, that's beat. so sad. He you can tell he's fucking. He tried to be. He just cut a stray. Yeah, for no reason. Like what? I'm fucking Calvin. What the fuck is this? Yeah, why you say fuck me? <laughs> but, but pretty much it. J Balvin, you'll be high, Perry. Yeah, he'll be, yeah high. he'll be fine. He'll come out in one of his shows, yeah. and they'll make up for it. And everyone's gonna be really loud, screaming, and yeah. Well, right now, a lot of the side, because especially people were judging Balvin, mm. is now people are more empathetic towards Balvin. True. So, like now, if you come out with something, I'm sure you're gonna get a better reception, receptive, like. This can work out in J Balvin's favor. And people favorite. are going to be tuned in like, oh, is he going to say anything about Bad yeah, Bunny now? Yeah, yeah. And, and yeah. fucking Residente, stop being a dick, fool. Yeah, he yeah, fucking Go fucking him. the fool. Like, that's, it's, it's lucky that was really fool. bad. It's lucky, dick. like, it's a little fucked up. He seems like, um, like you guys know Trick Trick in Detroit? Where no. he, like, has a no-fly zone where it's like, if you, you make me mad, like, that's Nobody it. fucks with you behind the scenes in Detroit. In the rap battle scene. Yeah. I know like, exactly what so you're talking about. So it kind of seems like that. Shout like, out Charlie Clips. I know because he talked about it with Arsenal. Yeah. I'm, I, I, like, I like watching the battle rap shit. But it's, yeah. It seems like he's kind of just like, nah, y'all don't fuck with this person because I say yeah. so type shit. So. All right. Well, you guys, before we get out of here, yeah. shout out Angie for the summer salam. That was great. That was great. And then do my shout out real quick. Um, love you. Love you. Shout out Letty. And hey. I'm also going to be, I don't know if everybody's going to be there, yes. but. I'm a, Rocha versus Santiago. That's going down at the Saturday we'll recap next episode. It's gonna at be the forum, which is gonna be fire because none of them are from LA, but they're fighting in LA, and I'm excited for I'm it. Like, like, yeah. Yeah. They're I'm fighting like, for I love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah they're they're fighting. Fighting. Santiago's from San Diego and Rocha's from, from Dolce. Yeah, yeah. 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 Gang, gang. Gang. we have to go see for. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, same high school. Yeah. Also, yeah. High school, uh, shout out Bobby and Rudy Roots from San Diego. Yeah, yeah. And lastly, make sure you get your tickets to the live show. Let's yeah. go, 23. Because live at the Wilton. You don't want to miss it. You guys, I'm, 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 like, I didn't want to tell you guys how many tickets we sold, but don't. No, 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 no. no. I'm saying it like yeah, in a change. sense to where like yeah, they miss out. They miss out. We told so, them. like yeah. we told you guys, Going we haven't fast. done a live show. We did the. The Paramount one, it was like very lightly, like it was fast. We a day, a one day promotion before. Yeah. You guys, this is gonna sell out. It's a warning. It's a warning. See ya. So, President Lincoln down the below, uh, December 23rd, we'll be at the World Turn in Los Saturday. Angeles. Come fuck with us. Bada bing, bada boom. Uh, me and Letty, I don't know where everybody's gonna be there, but we're gonna be at the Golden yeah. Boy Fire. I wanna be there this Saturday. weekend for the forum. forum. So, tap the fuck in. Yeah. And we out this motherfucker. And hey, shout out the watch. Bow. Watch it. Bow. Bow.